I believe this is on the VOD channel. I don't know, do, does the VOD channel, does it pick up the Twitch feed like two or three seconds late? I still have no clue. Today is Thursday, Wednesday. Today is Wednesday, not Thursday. How are you? If you're on the VOD channel, I appreciate you. This is day three. Sorry that the last day was cut a little bit short. Um, but I'm hoping we have to do today and then probably one more stream. This is probably going to be a pretty long one because there's still a lot of progress in the game and in the story that I want to hopefully make. I'm hoping that we can blow up the Pridwin with only two more of these streams. But we'll have to see. It could be it could get rough. Who knows? The beauty of all of these is we have no clue what lies next. Thank you, Karn, sir. Howdy. Napeta, thank you for 10 months. Minimum four more streams? I hope not. Because then that just means that the final video is going to take forever to put together. I started doing... Let me ask you guys. I didn't do this a lot in the last video. I maybe did it twice. I hope you guys didn't hear that. My body just made a strange noise. Um, let me ask you guys. I only did it a couple times in the most recent video. But... Are you guys chill if I did like more vlog type stuff like like if I delivered some of my narration on camera versus in engine, but like still did both of them, if that makes any sense. Because I started doing it a little bit to prepare for this Fallout video just to kind of try something new and I actually kind of like it. Here's to Juve Dad. Waffle, I appreciate it. Thank you. He's getting along pretty well. I haven't seen him in, I think, I think I saw him two days ago. I didn't see him yesterday, but he's coming along. It, it was cringe. Is that what you're saying, Melon? That's okay. Feels more real. If them, I mean, I guess that was kind of the point. Cause like, it, it's still like, 80 20 it's still like 80 percent of just the unedited game stuff on there with your encouragement i finished recording congratulations yokel you now have seven hours to edit down and i was wondering how you approach script writing do you do it in segments as you go along honestly i'm really messy with it i'm there are some days where I know the ending. I always like to know the ending as early as possible. That's why sometimes I struggle with, you know, do I get all 20 ish hours recorded and then start the project? Do I start the project as it goes through and try to keep usually the best method is to just start the project as I'm in the process of recording it so that I'm always thinking about it and then I can sleep Thank on certain you, things sir. and I remember the key aspects and key moments. Um, but I do like to understand what the ending is. I like to understand what I'm writing to get to. Although some people have probably noticed this. Sometimes when I have a project, I will, I'll be very long winded early on and then skip over or like rush through a ton of progress made during a challenge run. Sometimes that just comes down to putting so much time and effort on the front end and then kind of being like, shit, I got to finish this up. We got to we got to start wrapping up this story. So I don't know. I'm really, really messy. Sometimes all over the place. Sometimes it works. Sometimes it doesn't. Who knows? What's happening? Uh, we're about to jump back into what we've been doing. I haven't caught up on day two, so I don't know if I, uh, there isn't a ton on day two you would have missed. We did kill Kellogg. That was a pain in the ass. He kicked my ass multiple times. And we also started trying to get into a shootout with uh, with some Brotherhood of Steel helicopters, and it didn't go well. We've added a new rule to the challenge that if we see Brotherhood of Steel, it's basically on site. Or at least if we see their vertebrates. <clears throat> Have we? Yeah, we crafted clothes on the first stream. We ended up getting a deliverer on day two. That's been carrying us quite a bit. Did I just... Oh, I thought I exited out of my... Ah, oh, crap.
a god. How can you kill a god? Thank you. I, I broke something on my end. I'm a god. How can you kill a god? Shame on you, sweet Zerabar. Thank you, kind sir. Five months, time goes so fast. Love that you do. Thank you all. Uh, Fritz McLovin, thank you for gifting five to the community. It was very kind of you. Sorry, I missed that. I was in the process of my game basically exploding and not loading up properly. I started a new very hard playthrough on Fallout 4, doing a Deliverer High Luck run. CBBE is essential, though. <clears throat> Yami, I don't know about CBBE, but you know what? To each their own, if you want those beautiful round butts and those honking girthy well-endowed wasteland survivors if that's what you want in your game you are more than welcome to have it juve is my favorite celebrity i wish i was a celebrity actually no i don't parts of it would be kind of cool but I feel like the majority of it would suck. I wanted to say thank you for your content. You have inspired me to learn how to mod Fallout 4 for a crazy challenge run. That's awesome. What are you, what are you thinking of making? If you're doing a challenge run or you want to like put a mod together for one, that's dope. My mom's just turned 60 and started streaming Skyrim. She loves your content. Any tips for a newbie? Really? She likes. That just seems. Really? I got to make sure I get the right save loaded. I think this is the one we want. Hey, 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 you shut up. Is that a pip? Robots flying around with that copyrighted music? That what? copyrighted music nonsense? Okay, I need to get my bearings back a little bit because we didn't do this yesterday. Why do I have this gun? Where's my deliverer? Oh, I thought I lost it for a second. I about got worried. I thought my golden goose had left me. So we need some water, we need some food, I've got some disease. Do I have any money? I have eight caps, I do not have any money. Probably have enough to sell, we have a lot of junk. And then our current quest, talk to Dr. Amari. Listen to Valentine's Detective Agency radio. No, I don't think that's the one we want. Investigate the Brotherhood of Steel airship. Maybe we should go see our enemies. I mean, the Brotherhood of Steel have arrived in town. The Pridwin is nearby. We're fairly close to it. I don't see why we couldn't just go knock on their front door. Is that a pimp boy? No, this is just a regular pimp boy. Now I'm about to back out of my game and install that. Uh, do we have water? I don't have any water. You know, fine. I'm just gonna raw dog the lake over here. I need a drink. Okay, I'm not waiting for any of that purified nonsense. Everyone in the wasteland is trying to sell me on Aquafina. No, I take it all natural, baby. Mmm. So slow. You drink any slower, dude? Okay, my illness is persisting. Let's kill two birds with one stone while we're in town. We've got mongrel dog meat. Got some squirrel bits so we can eat. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. This is efficient survivalism. We drink the dirty water, collect some dirty water. Don't worry about the disease. So we're gonna come over here. Cook up some dog.
Enough, enough with the... Stop it. <laughs> what? Cut it out. All right. I don't need any claims. That was illegal. That was not cheating. <clears throat> hey, Doc. This better be an emergency. I need some supplies, Doctor. I suppose I could spare some stim packs. Should have enough to get some cash. 44 rounds, don't need them. 308 rounds, don't need them. Oh, I really don't have a lot to sell. I'll, I'll, I guess we'll get rid of Day Tripper. I'll keep Addict All in case of emergency. Radiated blood. Our combo drugs. I'm not going to need 19 stim packs. We'll dish out five. Let's get you examined right away. Time is not on the side of the surgeon. Then we'll just use the doctor. Catch me up, doc. Tell me your symptoms. I'm pretty beat up. Scrapes and 15 caps, disease is gone. Probably a good idea to get them fixed up. Why does this doctor buy ammo? Because it's the apocalypse. Ammos are, essentially ammos are currency. That's what I kind of like about the economy in Fallout 4. As easy as it is to exploit and break, if you're playing within sort of the confines of it without getting too crazy, Ammo is essentially currency when you're trading back and forth. So like if you're selling way too much to them, buy some ammo from them to even it out. Or if you're short, maybe spend some of your ammo to purchase something from them. How do you feel about 76 online and all that? I uh, think it's... I would... I would... I would prefer... They stick to just making, you know, single player games. But I think it's okay. I mean, I, I I think that there's obviously there's a lot of aspects of the the sort of loop that Fallout 4 did of go around the wasteland, shoot shit, loot shit, collect some junk, throw it all into your giant endless box of junk and then build shit. Like that's fun. That I honestly don't really ever get tired of that. So that being the core part of 76, I think that that's kind of enjoyable. Uh, I, I, I like, I think the map is good. I think the map is actually pretty dope. I don't like the art style though. It's a, it's a weird thing where like uh, I see, okay, so we need to get all the way, uh, this is a little bit high level. So it could get a bit crusty if we get in that direction. Am I allowed to say that? How the how am I still hungry? Three pounds of dog isn't enough to feed me. Also, where's Nick Valentine? I thought Nick was with me. No, I need backup. Oh, jeez. Okay. Where is Nick? Hello, Joy Boy Bubbles. How are you? Also, Marcus, thank you for the tier one. And uh, SMO, thank you for five months. I think I said that earlier, but... Just want to make sure I'm covering my tracks. Why would Nick abandon me? I guess I didn't officially ask him to be my follower. I didn't ask him out. He's not even in here. I didn't even listen to the detect. What is going? Where is he? Ellie. I'm glad you're here. We got a new case while you and Nick were out. Ready to put on the detective hat? Not particularly. I'm not very interested. But if it helps me find Nick, tell me more. Our client is a fisherman who lives on the edge of the Commonwealth, Kenji Nakano. Mr. Nakano. But if you want my guess. Uh huh. I'm busy right now. No, this is Far Harbor. Yourself. Ellie, stop it. The no, no, we're not covering Far Harbor on the channel yet. I, I've been talking about doing Far Harbor for a while, which we will. We will do Far Harbor. Just not right now. Oh, Far Harbor is going to be painful. It's going to be so painful, but it sh it'll be it'll end up being a lot of fun. So thirsty. Thank you, kind sir. Where's everyone running off to? Oh, wow. 
No, I'm not. I'm, I'm the same height as everyone else here. Okay, so I have no clue where Nick went. I don't know where Piper went. Uh, apparently Nick is at the Thank memory den. Oh, yeah, that's right. Nick probably went to Good Neighbor. He's at the memory den. Okay, fine. We won't go to the Brotherhood of Steel. Let's hit the memory den. Good Neighbor should be a fairly easy trip to make. Far Harbor Legendary Survival. Thankfully, there's no Legendary difficulty in Fallout 4. It's just survival. I wonder what would be harder. I would. I think Solstheim Legendary Survival would be harder. Uh-oh. Head on inside. All right, free loot. Everything outside the wall ain't safe. That's just how it is. I am not very tall. I'm 5'11", 3 quarters. Hi, I'm usually on the VODs. Gifted Pooh Bear, how are you? Oh, shit. I love this little thing, this little pea shooter. It's so underwhelming, but it's so good. Uh-oh. Sorry, dog, sorry. Okay, these people are gonna throw, yep, they're gonna throw Molotovs, so we gotta get out of here. Oh, the morning strolled a good neighbor, I love it. Is that Brotherhood of Steel? Fake Iron Men! All right, that was a stupid idea. I don't know if I can declare war on the Brotherhood of Steel yet. I probably shouldn't. I think it's a bit early. All right, let's hope it's not a bad one. Although it would be kind of fitting if we started this off with a really, really bad... Uh, is it food again? I gotta say, I'm undefeated. I am undefeated on the wheel. The wheel cannot beat me. I have to defeat two enemies, okay? The Brotherhood of Steel and that wheel. And continuously, I beat the wheel. We lost three mutt chops and some dirty water. That's it. Go ahead, try to take my guns from me, wheel. It's not happening. Diamond City is the place to live, I tell you. You made the right choice. Oh, that was such a dumb play. Why am I tired now? I wasn't tired last time. But I, I should have just let the Brotherhood of Steel fight the Super Mutants there, because one of them was legendary. I could have taken the legendary and scrapped it. Let's kill that dog again. <laughs> Come on, puppy. Alright, same shootouts going on down here. Good. I won't openly declare war on the Brotherhood, okay? I gotta watch out. Nice hit, nice. Nice. Oh, fantastic. Okay, at least we got the level up. I already have Gunslinger 3? We're doing really good damage. We could go Armor Rank 2, not a bad idea. We could finally start putting together some real armor. Adamantium Skeleton's not too bad. I also kind of like toughness, because then we can get DR without actually having to build any armor. We can just naturally have some resistance. I could also buy one of my strength points back because we lost it. I'm down one intelligence point. No. I did buy my strength point back. Because of the wheel, we have one less perception and one less intelligence. So we could try to get intelligence again. I don't know. What do you guys think? I'm leaning toughness. Aqua boy. Water is your ally. You no longer take radiation damage from swimming and can breathe underwater. You become totally undetectable while submerged. I feel like I'm not in the water that much. Chill with the dog killing. Bentley is right here. Give Bentley my best. 
Iron Belly. Take less radiation from eating and drinking. All right, we'll take Iron Belly. Lead Belly. Sorry, you're right. I'm an Iron Man with an Iron Belly. I could totally... I could totally kill this guy. I don't need any steel right now. Let's check and make sure they did have a legendary. Nah, no legendary this time. Thank you, kind sir. Can't believe it's been one year. Here's to another. Thank you. Pikmin, I appreciate it. Thank you for one entire year. You have been around for a while. I feel like I say the name a lot. Lead belly is trash. Non-radioactive food is not rare. Well, it, it, see, was this my chat just giving me bad advice then? Suggesting it? Okay, we're going the right way. I, had to, I just had to double check. Oh, I'm so lost. These streets are all so confusing. Oh, thanks, Vans. Never mind. I like how Vans just <laughs> decides to not work half the time. Okay, we're coming at a crossroads here. It'll be a left turn. Time's up. One's pushing. This is why we got the extended mags. Where are you, Raider Scaver? I can barely even see him. Fifty XP for that? That's a that's not that many shots to get fifty XP out of one kill. Got it. I'm not. I'm ironically using vans. Okay, I'm doing it as a bit. There's there's no yeah good one vans. Walk right through swamps lake. Fat chance. Sorry, it's a pond. Yeah, but you seem to be spending a lot of... What are you talking about? I got 105 bullets. That's going to be enough to take out the entire Brotherhood of Steel. I haven't been on a stream since one of your first Skyrim bingo attempts. Oh, those were a disaster. <laughs> I don't blame you. Those were a mess. Although once we figured it out, it was a lot of fun. Ghouls. Thank you, kind sir. I'm not wasting ammo. That might have been a waste, but it saved me. All right, we're 50 meters away. Everybody calm the fuck down. We're going to get to good neighbor. Okay. Mass fusion building up ahead. Watch out for the gunners. Watch out for landmines here as well. And then there's super mutants just to our side. I think there's a trap up here. What the hell are blood bugs doing up here? This is not the way to good neighbor. Oh, this sucks. This sucks. This sucks. Nothing behind me. Oh, I thought I saw a landmine. I gotta be careful. These raiders are gonna... One, two tap, three tap. I'm going the wrong way. I got myself looped around. Good neighbor should be right around the corner. Yeah, I went the wrong way. There's going to be feral ghouls up top of this garage, but I'm going to take it. All is well. 
You alone, Chad? I know, I have to focus up here. We just have to get to good neighbor. Raiders over there. Mass fusion to our left. There's going to be a landmine right on this corner. Right there. Wow, I really am starting to learn. What a shot. Uh, this gun is broken. In a good way. I mean, it makes me feel somewhat powerful. I'm only level 15, but I feel like I'm making quick work of downtown enemies. Like, look at that on a super mutant that's typically tanky. I'll leave him alone for now. Thank you, kind sir. So happy things have been better for you and your family. Chat always has your back with whatever you need. Alex, I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you for six months. All right, good neighbor. I finally get to kind of explore the content in here. I really haven't before. Hey, hold up there. First time in good neighbor? You can't go walking around without insurance. Yeah, right. Really? You think this guy is going to accept your insurance? You better back off, or you're the one who's going to need insurance. What was that? I, I couldn't hear over the sound of all that pathetic. You hand over everything you got in their pockets, or accidents start happening to you. You know what, Finn? Bloody accidents. You don't speak pathetic, and I don't speak bitch. A little bloodthirsty, are we? Fortunately, you picked the right town. Don't, don't, you can't just show up out of nowhere and start judging me, Nick. Okay, I made the right decision. Walk into a new place. I'm done with you, Nick. We're breaking up. It's over. Hancock. Of the people for the people. Welcome to the team. Everyone's welcome. Yeah, I feel you. Good. You stay cool, and you'll be part of the neighborhood. So long as you remember who's in charge. Are you still romancing Preston? Pfft. Preston is so old news. No, I want to romance Hancock now. Well, hello. Everything here is guaranteed to injure, <clears throat> maim, no or horny in chat. Discretion. No Cleo Except horniness today. I only kill what I want to. Let's see what you've got. Each weapon tested on someone who deserved it. I bet no, no, no. I see where you all are going with this. No. Okay. I want to hold on to 45 rounds. Thank you, kind sir. My kid woke me up early, Sag, but now I can watch stream poggers. Illy. Your kid woke up early? That's a bummer, but at least they are enjoying the day. Oh, you guys want to hear something terrible? All right, so I completely forgot that yesterday was Halloween, okay? <clears throat> and I live in a neighborhood now that, you know, has trick-or-treaters. And I completely forgot about this. And yesterday I was like, I was editing or I was working on something, and I hear the doorbell ring, and I'm like, oh, no. I was like, oh, God, this is going to be my neighbor because I complained about them climbing on the fucking roof at 4 a.m., which I told you guys that story the other day about. So I go down to the door. I open it up and it hit me. There are these two little girls there. One was dressed as like she was a witch. They, they were no older than five years old. They were just all excited to be out trick or treating. They were so sweet. And I just had to stand there and be like, no candy. Nothing. Yeah, I can give you channel points. <laughs> you guys want a free gift sub? But I felt so... I felt so bad. Uh, but their mom was really nice. She was like, oh, no worries. It's okay. Uh, just so you know, you have your uh, you have your front porch light on 
and there's about 25 kids walking around the neighborhood. And I was like, okay, good to know. So then I shut my light off, crawled back into my chamber. But I did, I did feel, I did feel pretty bad. All I'm saying. Cause then I thought I was like, well, damn, when I was a kid, if I rolled up to a house and this guy answered the door and was like, no candy, I'd be like, whoa, whoa, what was wrong with that guy? <laughs> What's his problem? So yeah, I hate kids. Oh, yeah, that's the takeaway. That's, that's how Twitch chat works. And you're not even screaming yet. Very polite. You let me know if anything catches your fancy. Wait, I can't buy food. I'm forgetting the rules. I'm going crazy, losing my mind. Now I've seen a lot of crazy stuff in my time, but a flying ship? Whoever this Brotherhood of Steel is, I'm not buying that. I should have some stuff to cook. I don't have stuff to cook. I just cooked. What is going on with my head today? I think I'm just... Whenever I go a day without playing one of these and I jump back into it, it takes me like an hour and a half to be like, okay, here's what's, here's what's going on, here's what we're doing. Is there not a spout in town that I can drink from? Noodle Cup helped out a lot. All right, let's do some more storyline. That's what I'm here for. I'm here for the main quest and the main quest only. Mr. Valentine, I thought you had forgotten about the Lomi. May have walked out of the den, Irma, but I'd never walk out on you. Look at you, you sly little robot. Mari's downstairs, you big flirt. Here for Amari, she's downstairs. Irma. Whatever you Irma. and Nick are up to, I don't Irma. want to know. Just don't let the big metal softy hurt himself. Oh, that's so sweet. She actually really likes Nick. Hey, you trying to get us in trouble? Oh, you're such a goody little two shoes. Come on. What is this, Starfield? Fuck out of here, Nick. Doctor, Why don't you go join, jo go join Constellation, you goody two shoes? Get, get, get out of my crew. This is see. This is why I'm breaking up with him. Oh, Jabba, what's up? Are you are you live right now? Or are you just chilling? We need your help, Doctor. I need the memories from a man named Kellogg. But he's dead. I know it's asking for a miracle, Omari. But you've pulled off the impossible before. City Skylines 2. Oh, best of luck. I've heard rave reviews. I've heard fantastic things about it. You don't realize that the memory simulators require intact, living brains to function. I, I wasn't paying attention. I'm just gonna keep, I'm just gonna insult people. Some expert you are. I knew this was a waste of time. This dead brain had inside knowledge of the Institute, Amari. The biggest scientific secret of the Commonwealth. You need this, and so do we. Fine. I'll take a look. But no guarantees. Do you have it with you? Could you say that like Dr. Frankenstein? Ego, fetch me the brain. No. That, that, that was actually kind of funny. All right, all right, I'll give it to him. That was kind of funny. Just get a better PC. You know what? You know what? I'll, I'll, I'll work on it. Here's what I could find. What's this? This isn't a brain. This is, wait. It looks like an appendix. And this I would know, I had mine taken out. A neural interface? Speaking as a non-appendectomic, um, a, a non- From what I've seen, all institute technology has a similar architect. Appendemic? Speaking as a non-appendemic, uh, I, th I think that would be the right word. Uh, Speak, speaking as a, I, I think I know what it looks like. Skip to the good part, Doc. We plug the brain implant into Mr. Valentine, assuming he's willing to take on the risks. Hell, why not? Plenty of room in my head anyway. All right, ChatGPT, you're up. 
I appreciate this, Nick. You can thank me when we've found your son. All right, let's do this. Whenever you're ready, Mr. Valentine, just sit down. If I start cackling like an old grizzled mercenary, pull me out, okay? Let's see here. I need you to keep talking to me, Mr. Valentine. Hey, you're not putting anything in there. You're not even touching him. Are you feeling any different? There's a lot of flashes. Static. I, I, it is kind of funny. Make sense of any of it's kind of believable if you stand right here, but if you just look behind it, the mnemonic her hands are just floating there. It appears the Institute has one last failsafe. There's a lock on the memories and the implants. More problems. Seriously? It's not like anyone has ever done this before. You try making a secret technology work across hardware generations out of spare parts. Just let me think. The encryption is probably meant to keep a single mind from... Was Dr. Amari in Fallout 3? So, what if we used two? We load Was she? both you and Mr. Valentine into the memory loungers. Run your cognitive functions in parallel. He'll act as a host. While your consciousness drives no. through whatever Dr. Lee. We can find. That's who I was thinking of. All right. Let's get started. Just sit down over there and keep your fingers crossed. See you on the other side. I don't like this. No. Ooh, immersive first person animation. I wish this was Tranquility Lane too. This is exactly like Tranquility Lane. Initiating brainwave migration between the transplant and the host. Did I see the emasculator mod for New Vegas? I did. Very immersive. Time for the worst part of Fallout 4. Uh, this is not Dima's memories. But this part is pretty long. Let's start the timer now. Uh, how, how can we do an over under gamble on how long this part takes? Have you played this in VR? I've never played Skyrim or Fallout in VR. I really want to. The simulation appears to be working, although the memories are quite fragmentary. Oh, I do not remember this. I'll try to step you through the intact memories and hope we find one that gives us some clue to the Institute's location. There. This is the earliest intact memory I can find. Remember, you oh, he had a rude dad. This may prove disorienting at first. Do I have to go through all these? Oh, I gotta go through this them all. Doesn't seem to be what we're looking for. Oh, oh, okay, we can skip it. Who needs lore? Appears to be another intact memory close to you. Thank you, kind sir. There. Jane, thank you for ten whole months. Me, Sarah. Who's Sarah? The thing about happiness is, is you only know you had it when it's gone. I mean, you, you, you may kind think sir. to yourself that you're happy, but uh, trick me, I appreciate you it. Don't really believe it. You focus on the petty bullshit or next job or whatever. It's only looking back, by comparison with what comes after, that you really understand. That's what happiness felt like. Yeah, I do remember the first time going through this. I really enjoyed it. You'll see. But we don't know anybody. I'm a god. Shame. I'm a god. A this is not the time to start dancing. It does give Max Payne vibes. How can you kill a god? Shame on you, sweet man of God. Shane, I appreciate that. Gifting 10. That's very kind of you. How are you, Shane? Are you sure these guys know what they're doing? They seem kind of green. I know, but that's where I come in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got a nice sob story. I'll connect you to the next intact memory. This whole sequence feels very remedy. And yes, I am very biased because I just finished Alan Wake 2 and it was fucking awesome. <laughs> it was awesome. Absolutely awesome. 
How did you think this was going to end, Kellogg? I'm going to be that annoying Alan Wake fan for the next. <laughs> you thought you could just fuck with us, and we wouldn't fuck with you? Just so you know, they died like dogs. And you I found another memory weren't to there to help connected. them. All right, somebody in chat said that if I go too quickly, it could break the quest. Let's just hope that doesn't happen. Mind if we sit down? Suit yourself. So, um, I hear you'll take care of people's problems. Is that right? If you pay me. Oh, we'll pay you. And uh, you'll do this all by yourself? That's right. We pay you when the job is done. Is that okay? Well, we seem to be getting closer. Try this next one. Be kind of cool if you could get Kellogg, like reincarnated as a synth, to be a companion. Mr. Kellogg, I'm glad you decided to meet with me. So, you're with the Institute. In fact, that would be badass, because he's already dead at this point, and you get all this backstory on him. And he does have kind of a cool backstory. Do, as you can see. What do you want? It's come to my attention that you've been rather disruptive of our operations lately. This must stop. I do what people pay me to do. If that's a problem. Nazaki. No, I, 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 I feel that. One way out. And what's that, Mr. Kellogg? If I'm working for you, there's no more problem. From what I hear, you can afford me. I don't think you fully understand the situation you're in. I think I do. Very well. B-748, initiate. Thank you, Khan, sir. Oh, that was as Half anime as it stream, gets. Baby. Thanks for keeping me entertained during Impressive. work. Keely, we may have something to talk thank about you for paying all. just enough attention to the stream There's and to work that you kept both your job and can watch the stream. Thank you for five months. Ah, uh, oh, there's one that looks mostly intact. Connecting now. Manual override. Thank you, kind sir. Here we go. Cryogenic stasis. Making me relive Suspense. the most haunting memory of my entire life. But this is how you Ball build up true stolen. iron within yourself. Checking through the logs. Hopefully it's all... Just find it. Pod C6. Down the hall near the end. Dr. Julik, thank you for the prime. <gasps> Wait, that's not me. Where's me? Haha, <laughs> there I am. God, I look so good right in that pod. I'm so absolutely shredded. Look at the pectorals. Look at the traps. Is that what these are? Look at the jawline. The hair. I mean, everything is just so pristine. They had to have seen me frozen in here and just been like, look at that specimen. <laughs> Oh, and my wife. Are we okay? Almost. Everything's gonna be fine. Come here. Come no, here, wait. baby. No, no. I've got him. Let the boy go. I'm only gonna tell you once. I'm not giving you Sean! What a terrible strategy. God. She just woke up from a coma. You Get could, I don't know. Let's go. Could have been a little bit nice, sir. Get out of my face. Why am I the backup? <laughs> He's cheering. He's like, yeah, I'm the backup. All right. He's all excited. I'm getting out of here one day. All right. We're good. I don't I don't I don't understand, though, why. I'm sorry you had to go through that again. I found another like Kellogg, my man, terrible negotiator. All he had to say was be like, listen, ma'am, we are from the future. OK, calm down. You've been frozen for a while, but in order to save the planet, we, we need to take you and your kid down to some science place for some science shit. Is that your son? This appears to be a very recent memory. So, good news, I think. Sean. Wasn't my idea to settle down with the kid in the middle of Diamond City. 
I thought it was a terrible idea, actually. But it was one of the old man's pet projects, so here we were. Me and the kid. Like I this isn't actually kid. Sean, this is a synth. I ended up kind of liking it. Because when he but says I'm old man, he's life talking life about Sean. Things had turned out different. Yeah, that's, I, I can understand what's happening. But there's no going back. I knew it was just temporary. It'd be back to normal business before too long. This part is long. Wrong way? Oh, fuck me. I went the wrong way. I'm enjoying this, though. Mainly because it's just been so long. This whole setup in Diamond City was part of some elaborate plan of the old man's. Seems obvious now. Wait a minute, that's actually Max Payne's voice actor. We were bait for our friend from the vault. Timing couldn't have been an accident. It's not how the old man works. I wonder if he outsmarted me in the end. Another loose end tied up. Kellogg. It's okay. One of these days you're gonna get your head blown off just barging in here like that. And when I say Max Payne, I mean Alex Casey. Forget I said anything. So what's the big crisis this time? New orders for you. One of our scientists has left the Institute. Left? As in? He's gone rogue. Name's Dr. Brian Virgil. We know he's hiding somewhere in the glowing sea. Here's his file. This guy's chat GPT. Wow. In human form. Some heads are gonna roll for this. Capture and return, or just elimination? Elimination. He was working on a highly classified program. No kidding. One of the top bioscience boys? Damn. I thought so, Dance was, Dance is ChatGPT. He's been infected by AI. Yeah. Affirmative. Your only mission is to locate and eliminate Virgil. You're taking me home to my father? Yes. Stand next to me and hold still. It's not your father, Sean. Okay. I am. Also, wait, no, there's no way that's my kid. Look at that weak chin. He doesn't even have abs. <laughs> this kid sucks. No, I don't want it. No, no, that hair. What is that? X6 uh, actually, I can't make fun of that hair because that's like the exact same haircut I have right now. I was about to start making fun of him for his like... Sunday church haircut, but I'd be I wouldn't really be able to do that Nobody's found the entrance to the Institute because there is no entrance Let me pull you out of there as soon as you're ready Oh my gosh another Alan Wake reference I'm loving this whole quest I should have put the Giga Chad preset on Nora as well, just to have the highest opportunity of this child. I don't know what kind of side effects the procedure might have had. Slow movement. No one's ever done this before. How do you feel? Thank you, kind sir. Dr. Romari. Let's start over. Valentine liked that. What did Valentine like about that? I have this burning feeling inside my skull. It's like it's on fire. That's not surprising. All the synapses in your brain have just pandemic games one of my favorite old developers and then pull back together i injected you with a lot even though it was pandemic games but i appreciate it thank you for the prime that should ease things are you ready to talk about what happened in there i saw kellogg's life the man look at the neck i mean the neck is so looks like a baseball glove he was a human being just like the rest of us and he had reasons for being what he was, however cruel. How does that make you feel? You know what? I forgive Kellogg. I forgive him. I think he was just a, a rough guy put in a tough spot 
who was trying to survive on his own. It, it wasn't all his fault. I can't blame him for everything that if happened. If I were a priest, I would say... Why does Kellogg have to be dead? We are getting off track. He's so cool. <laughs> He's so cool. Why? Teleportation. The only question Damn it. What do we do now? I wasn't expecting to come into this storyline and come out of it with feelings for one of these characters. That scientist Kellogg was supposed to track down. Virgil, we need to find right. him. A rogue institute scientist could answer all kinds of questions. Where did the memory say he was? The glowing sea? That doesn't make sense. No one goes there. Not even if they were desperate. If we need to find Virgil, then I'm going after if him. If you're going to go, be prepared. You'll need some way to combat the radiation there. It's called the Glowing Sea for a reason. I'll find a way to get through the rads. Don't worry. Good luck. Dr. Amari, I don't know if you've ever seen this channel before, but I kind of know a thing or two about the Glowing Sea. Alright. While you were waking up. Don't ask me about episode four. Just don't. Don't, just don't ask me about episode four, okay? The glowing sea. Knowing what I know about the glowing sea, we should not need any type of radioactive protection to get down there. Hey, Valentine. Hope you got what you were looking for inside my head. <laughs> that was right. I should have killed you when you were on ice. Uh, I forgot about this part, but this is actually pretty sweet. Juve, today some creep dude looked at my young nephew really weirdly, so I say, what you looking at? And he walks off after that. Nothing to say. I was talking to my chat, Kellogg. Is that you? What? What are you talking about? You sounded like Kellogg just then. Did I? Huh. Mari said there might be some mnemonic impressions left over. Anyway, I feel fine, so let's get going. I'm gonna head out on my own from here, Nick. Good luck out there. You know where to find me. I don't need you, Nick. All right? There's a lion inside me just waiting to be released upon the wasteland. And by that, I mean I'm gonna go pick up either McCready or... Sounds like Ellie needs to talk to us. We should head back now, to the office doing next chance. Right. Should we go with Hancock or McCready? Hey, Daisy. Glad you could make it. How's my favorite girl doing? Didn't I see you on a date with Lomrowski the other day? Huh. He wishes. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. We're getting off track. What was I saying? Oh, that's right. What matters? I think everybody wants me to pick Hancock just so that I have to say cock a ridiculous amount of times throughout this. I, I, I know how Twitch chat works. Twitch chat hears cock and they're like, that one! What out there in our big friend? That one! Wanna drive us apart. We want the cock! McCready is easier to recruit. You can't afford McCready? That feels like a coming up to my office later. You've earned yourself some interest. You're coming at my net worth? And as somebody who loves making money in these games, I can promise you, 67 caps. Okay, that's like the median income yearly for a resident of Good Neighbor. I don't know, Hancock. I'd sure love to give McDonough a kick in the ass. <laughs> hey, we all know I got my own personal beef with that lard head. But stay focused. Now, I want everyone to keep the Institute in mind when someone starts acting funny. When people are doing things they don't normally do. When family starts pushing you away for no reason. We all know who's behind that kind of shit. And the only way to stop it is to stick together. They can't control us if we're not afraid. Now, who's scared of the Institute? Not Low-key, low I am. I, I have good reason to be, though. I don't know about the rest of you guys. Good, good neighbor. And who's in charge of good neighbor? Cock! Now, I don't really like Hancock here because it's like he's basically saying, oh, if you have a disagreement with your family member, that just means they're a synth. You should kill them.
Stop. Stop. Stop cock spamming in chat. Hancock says newcomers are welcome in the third round. All right, you know what? Let's just grab McCready. Even though y'all say I can't afford him, watch me. Can't say I'm surprised to find you in a dump like this, McCready. I was wondering how long it would take your bloodhounds to track me down, Winlock. It's been almost three months. Don't tell me you're getting rusty. Should we take this outside? It ain't like that. I'm just here to deliver a message. I haven't saved in quite a long time. Good. Yeah, I heard. But you're still taking jobs in the Commonwealth. That isn't going to work for us. I don't take orders from you. Not anymore. So why don't you take your girlfriend and walk out of here while you still can? What? Hey, McCready. Winlock, tell me we don't have to listen to this shit. Listen up, McCready. The only reason we haven't filled your body full of bullets is that we don't want a war with Good Neighbor. See? Is this we like the only gunner's lore in the game? Boundaries. We know how to play the game. It's something you never learned. Glad to have disappointed you. <laughs> you That's not what Hancock means. Let's say your family member hates spaghetti. If they randomly started eating spaghetti, then they're a sin. That's what he meant. Okay. That makes more sense. You finished. But if anybody didn't want to eat spaghetti in the apocalypse, I'd probably think they were a synth. Um. Look, pal. If you're preaching about the atom or looking for I'm interested. If you think you've got what it takes. You're joking, right? I've been doing this since I was a kid. I know my way around. I used to run with the gunners, for God's sake. Sounds like you can handle yourself. If you're worried about Winlock and Barnes, don't. And what about you? All I can give you is my word. And a bunch of caps. A bunch of caps, huh? Price is 250 caps. 250 caps up front. I'm really broke. <laughs> I don't like doing business. Look, come back when you have. Yeah, I've got I've got a ton of caps for you, but I'm also incredibly broke. Sorry, McCready, I I have no money. Oi, we got beer. You ain't bothered. Let's see what you have. All right, I need to get rolling here. We're we're wasting a lot of time in Good Neighbor. I've been kind of enjoying it though. Oh god, I gotta I gotta get more rid of more stim packs. I don't need that many. Does that bring me up to 250? No, not yet. I'm I've gotta keep the rat away. I have no clue what this does. Cybernetic limb actuator? I feel like this stuff is gonna be important, but I don't remember what it's for. Alright, we got enough for McCready. They're, oh, they're just for cash. You still looking for work, McCready? That depends. You ready to fork over 250 caps? Everything's negotiable. Would you take 200? Something along with your hearing? I just told you I'm not going to negotiate. So are you in or? Uh huh. You've got a deal. Now you're speaking my language. All right, boss. You got yourself an extra gun. Lead on. All right, McCready. We're gonna have to craft you a new outfit, though. I'm not digging the whole get up here. Recruit five separate companions. That's awesome. We've up, we're all the way up to five. That's a new record. I've gotten so many achievements on this run. We're going to have to find some food on our way to the glowing sea. I think we're okay, though, to go from here. Oh, yikes. We have to get all the way across. Okay, well, you know what? Let's let's make use of our fast travel ability. We can go from settlement to settlement. So good neighbor to Diamond City. That's within our rules. So we go good neighbor to DC. And then it's a short run to the Glowing Sea. I know how to get to the Glowing Sea from here. It shouldn't be that bad. Been to Diamond City in years. I'll tell you, nothing's changed. Which ammo do I have? Ninety-one bullets. You think ninety-one bullets is enough? Thank you, kind sir. 
USB device, congratulations on a Twitch baby. Oh, it is nine months. What would you like to name baby USB Diamond. device? And, uh, All right, you. Tell me. Well, Diamond me City of Radio is like terrible, our... yes? It makes you want to cut your own Diamond ears City off. Surplus. Now open 24 hours a day. Management reserves the right to refuse Oh, I don't care. I just want to rent a bed. Yeah, it's... This is what I... Uh -huh. Either we... But it's true. Someone... I don't... Sounds good to me. Oh, all right. I'm gonna stop you there. We're not amateurs, you know? McCready liked that. Okay, okay, all right. I don't really know what I did, but McCready's a fan of it. Right. We're all just having a laugh. Hey, okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, Travis, and so he's... He does not... Be. Well... Exact. Go on. Come, you... Hey, you fiend. Tell me if you need a room. Otherwise... I like how the main room. takeaway from the quest... Uh, the confidence man Room two is yours. with the guy in the radio it's really just hey if you need some confidence in your life go uh get in a shootout with some gangsters it's gonna really it's gonna really ramp up your confidence have a nice day now i'm just thirsty Slightly hungry. Hey, you're that vault dweller from the paper. We'll find food on the way there. There's a couple of danger points that I want to keep an eye out for. But I think for the most part, I'm going to be okay getting down to the glowing sea in one go. Getting through the glowing sea, that might be a bit tougher. I'm going to try to keep an eye out for a checkpoint that I can get somewhere close to the entrance to the glowing sea. But I don't know if, like, I haven't actually been to the glowing sea since the original glowing sea region lock that we recorded. Honestly, I haven't played down there. I haven't messed around down there. However, I spent roughly 30 hours in total only in the glowing sea. So I have a really good idea of the main key points and places that we want to hit. We want to get into the glowing sea. We enter through here. There's going to be the church somewhere around here that's full stocked to the brim with feral ghouls. But the I main place we want to find, we're not going to be able to take the power armor because we have to craft our own power armor. So we probably want to hit the giant pyramid down here. And then maybe right away we can sleep in this pyramid once it's cleared out. We clear out the big pyramid. And that should afford us some time to get down to Virgil. The pyramid might be closer to like down here. But it's very easy to see in the distance. Once I get to the glowing sea, I'm going to have a good idea of where we're going. So we hit pyramid, clear it out, get the checkpoint, sleep down there. And then we can probably leapfrog our way from the pyramid to Virgil. Also, if someone is setting up a gamble right now, don't make it like, do I die one time? I'm obviously going to die. <laughs> I'm going to die. You got to make it a little bit more interesting. How many times may I die? Will I reach? Can I hit level? Oh my God, we're almost level 17. Can I hit level 20 before I die? X times. A little bit longer with the gambles. Some of the some of the quick hitter ones are a bit too fast. Food. Legendary. What a waste of ammo to start this journey. At least we can scrap it. Scrap it three times. Holy frames. Seventy six rounds. Hundred and one rounds here. Let's swap to this bad boy for a bit. How much? What's the damage difference between the two? 
Deliverer does a little bit more, and obviously because it shoots so much faster, it has a longer clip, it's, it's gonna DPS, it's gonna blow out this gun. But it's worth it just for these handful of kills we're gonna get. Oh, we went the perfect route. Because up this road, we caught up that road. It takes us to all the super mutants. <clears throat> I think this bridge might be trapped. If we were playing, if we had turned on automatron and the automatron random encounters were going around, this would be so much harder. Uh oh, here we go. Do your thing, McCready. Legendary. Oh, come on. What in the... How damn time. We're getting really lucky now. Multiple uh, legendaries are dropping. Starting to get some of our power level back. Take a quick nap so we can save. <gasps> oh no, can I not? Oh wait, it doesn't matter. I don't have to stay on the road. Sometimes, like, I convince myself that we're still doing an older challenge. Like, some, sometimes my head goes, okay, I'm on the road. I got to stay on the road. I can't leave the road. But no. I don't have that limitation. I feel so free. Thank you, kind sir. Our baby is nearly due. Shark me, you got to keep thinking of a good name. A huge, huge, huge super mutant encounter right ahead of us here if i am remembering properly raider scum psycho hey they might do some decent damage we can't turn down this xp though Where I heard something. oh crap i'm stuck around the trees Are these guys really coming in to steal my kills? Get out of here. Oh, do I open fire on it? <laughs> I really want to just shoot down the vertebrates so bad. Wait, they went hostile. Why'd they go hostile? I didn't do anything. I think they know my mission. Take it out, McCready. Oh God, that thing's got range. <laughs> McCready, you're on your own. Take out the helicopter. Down with the brotherhood. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, I've got a tree here. Now, let's just make sure that we optimize this battle. I'm going to take toughness because it's the most immediate need that I have. But I think we're fortunate right now. I think we're fortunate that the vertebrate itself only has a turret on one side. It's going down. It's going down! Oh, I forgot it could kill me if it lands on me. It hit me at the last second. It hit me right at the end that if I blow it up, it's going to land on me and the explosion's going to kill me. <laughs> God dang it. At least we killed it. At, at least we killed a vertebrate.
Riyadh lost special. I mean, like, I'll take a special point pack, but that's just, no. Sorry, I need something bad to happen. I've won too many spins in a row. Okay, that's what I'm talking about. Now we have something happening. Now we've, lo now we've lost something. Oh, God, no, this sucks. This really sucks. This just completely stops me from going into the glowing sea. Shit. I actually screamed at you through my phone? Wait, why? Because I died there? I get my special point back. Okay. I'm taking that point back to intelligence. Now we get a little bit more XP. I don't need meds to get through the glowing sea. <clears throat> it's completely, f it's a false notion. I understand the glowing sea like the back of my ass. Just you wait. How often do you see the back of your ass? None of your business. Incoming Brotherhood of Steel Chopper. No raider spawn here, so no free XP. I wonder where they're going. Maybe we could use them as a sort of guard or a guide. We're already getting shot at by super mutants. Oh shit. Oh, come on, you little assholes. understand why the vertebrate goes hostile. I didn't do anything to it. I gotta get in cover. As soon as the vertebrate turns on me, it's gonna be able to melt me. Protection, park protection. Okay, okay, all right. If the vertebrate's gonna come over here to this little park, then let's activate every single one of these protections. H-A-R-D. Mm. Ba, 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 ba. No, zero. Okay, so it's not H or D, it's A R. A R in the middle. Earn. Yes. Try and control, choose personality mode. How do I make them my friend? <clears throat> Anybody know how I make them my friend? Thank you, kind sir. Half a year and still no Fall Guys 2023 review. Uh, well, we're waiting until, until 2024. We're waiting until it gets a new update. Medical or law? Okay, we'll go law. <clears throat> and then I just won't break the law. Activate. Activate. Oh, there's too much going on. Go forth, my soldiers. We've got a helicopter. Half a knot west. I mean east. Oh, you're going the wrong way. <clears throat> it's spinning. It's falling. It's going down. <laughs> it's down. That's right. Down with the system. What do they got on him? Hold on. I feel like one of these cars might explode. Got 
Gotta keep an eye on my radiation. They must have killed the super mutants. No. Oh, th I heard... I heard the railway rifle, and I just had Vietnam flashbacks of uh, the Automatron DLC. I was not ready for that to be on the map. But I forgot about the Protectrons. I forgot about my honorable service members. Gentlemen, Thank you, kind for your brave sir. sacrifice in the line of duty, we all salute you on this day. Please remember to, I don't, I don't, I don't know. Just go about your business. I have a mission. Oh, fucking A, McCready. I thought you were the Deathclaw. Go get him, robots! They don't need my help. We will always honor and remember your sacrifice. I'm stuck. They're doing good damage. They're doing great damage. Let's go, push. We're on the offensive. We got this. Oh my god, you guys kick ass! Can I take you all with me? I need an army, let's go to the glowing sea together. Come on, as a team! Oh, that death claw did get me though, that scared the hell out of me. Ooh. See, like I said, no problem. Super easy to get down to the edge of the glowing sea. Uh, I need to find a bed, though. I really could use a checkpoint. Let me double check this house. No, no bed. It's got to be a place that I can rest. Because I'm going to try to run through the glowing sea multiple times. If I can start there at level 1, I can do it at level 15. I think that there's a camp. I want to say there's a camp just outside on the edge of the glowing sea. I know there's a gunner camp up on the highway. That's risky, though, if we want to try and take it over. bed oh come on I don't know why I thought that there was a bed here ah I knew it what did I tell you hmm? Hmm? and there's a cooking station here That's big. We don't have any healing items. I'm only going to be able to get three hours of sleep. God, I'm really running into the glowing sea at midnight. I couldn't find a better time of day to run through. It's dark. It's hard to see. It's scary. Okay, if I remember properly, we're going to want to go on a straight line. As soon as I see the church, we can... Is this really the time, McCready? Okay, yeah, go ahead. As soon as we cut through straight, we see that church. We can angle to our right, and if we angle to our right, we're going to be able to find the factory. At the bottom of the factory, there's going to be six or seven rad away. That could be an important first place to go to. I don't remember exactly where cave is. Cave is where you can find a suit of power armor. Since we haven't crafted a power armor frame, we cannot wear power armor. 
So the first order of business is going to be finding the church. That's the first main point of interest. Avoid the church because of the radiation. And in case of emergency, hit that first bunker and loot Thank you, the uh, right away from the bottom floor. I think that's going to be our play here, and I really want to get this on the first try because I've talked a lot about my expertise in the glowing sea. I claim to be a glowing sea survival expert. I should be able to do this on one try very easily with no problems whatsoever. There's a legendary raider above us that wants to kill us, so let's move. We're going to have to watch our AP the entire time as well. I'm going I'm to be limited on sprint. Okay, the rads are kicking in. We're getting two per second. <clears throat> I guess I could take... Am I hungry right now? I am hungry. So let's take the Deathclaw steak. It's a small buff to our agility. Not sure if that helps much, but we'll try. I have almost no sprint. All right, so I think... There's the church, because we need to head straight south. I'm going to have to keep my gun out the whole time. Church, looks like that's cave right next to us. We're looking for a factory. I'm going to try and get the right away at the factory first and foremost. Because I think at most in the basement of that factory, we'll find one glowing one. <clears throat> There's the downed airplane. We want to move west. See the church? There's the steeple. Open the doors. There are all the people. Factory straight ahead of us. Yeah, there's the church. Deathclaw's gonna be right on this bridge. Let me make sure I at least get my sprint back. The hell's the Deathclaw? There he is. Should be okay if we run. Get some stuff in his way. Some rocks. Looks like he didn't follow us. Doing well. Yeah, yeah, here's the lake. Oh my gosh, it's so strange to be here in the Glowing Sea without the big settlement that we put together for the Glowing Sea region lock, but here it is. Yeah, get your before and after shots ready. Fuck. <clears throat> okay, we need to get inside. Capsized factory. This is the first spot that we want. Let's funnel them in through the front door. Come on, McCready. Don't have time for bloat flies. Inside, we are we're only at half health, so we're still doing okay. It's going to be loaded with feral ghouls. Got to make our shots in here count more than anything. One hit and I probably go down. Check for ammo. No ammo. No ammo. Don't want him to catch me on the pipe. Okay, let's get through here. There's not going to be a lot of loot. There's our ammo. Fuck off. Stay dead. Another one. Got our right away. Plenty of drugs. Can't unlock it, but we got uh, we got a right away. I think we got about five in total there. Only downside, I think, is that it makes us hungry and our immune system is going to be shitty. All right, so we're fighting off at least some of that radiation, but it's really slow. Three more right away. Red X, more right away. This is a respawning location too. So we are able to come back here if we have to. It's gonna be really tough without water though. Let's take one more right away. Overtired from a lack of sleep. Ooh, this over encumbers me. 
Yeah, my carry weight's taking a huge hit. I'll drop that legendary. And I'll drop that legendary. I'll drop the two legendaries that I have. I don't need crafting materials right now. So we'll burn those. Oh, no, 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 no. I just ran into the worst little vat of reds I could have found. All right, we head south. We should easily make it to the big giant triangle, the giant pyramid. I think I also might see Virgil's cave on the map. Can we make it to Virgil's cave? I don't know what McCready's shooting at, nor do I care. Gotta get my sprint back. We're gonna have riot scorpions jump us at any moment. Oh, speak of the devil. There he is. Heal your... McCready! What did you get involved in? Uh, now McCready's abandoned me. Alright, sweet. I've been dumped by yet another companion. I don't remember what cave this is. It's not my cave, though. That might just be where the power armor is. Is it called cave? Yeah, that's where the power armor is. Ooh, Deathclaw. There is no awkward terrain here for me to throw in front of the Deathclaw. So if he comes after us, we're fucked. Airplane right here. This, ta this is taking us out of our path. I need to move this way. But I need to get clear of the Deathclaw first. Probably shouldn't be doing that. But this is gonna take our radiation pretty much to zero. Another factory right there. That's a repeatable location. We exploited that for a lot of XP when we stayed in the glowing sea. But now we've got the big giant triangle. Is it even a triangle? Or a pyramid? Just like that. <laughs> nice and easy. Easy. We're fine. We are completely fine. We need to sleep it off. We're a little bit hungover. Imagine dying to radiation in the glowing sea. Could never be me. I forgot about the alarms in this place, they're annoying. Oh, it was so fun when we first did the glowing sea and we first got into this place. Nice. It was so exciting. Over encumbered from a magazine? No, over encumbered because drugs wore off. I gotta lose four pounds. Must remain closed during, oh, we have to cancel the launch. I don't remember how. I feel like it might be down lower. Part of me thinks that it's on that platform too and I just missed it. Yeah, we're heading to the bottom because there's beds down there. If I only had a bobby pin. Oh! Out of bobby pins. No bobby pins. I don't know who it was that was crying and moaning in chat the other day about bobby pins on the wheel not being a punishment to land on. Don't have any bobby pins. Hmm. 
out of bobby pins. No bobby pins. No bobby pins. It's funny how that plays out sometimes. It's just funny how that plays out sometimes. Don't need hammers. I am carrying a lot of stupid junk. I, I drop a bunch of junk because I'm carrying too much and then I'm like, hmm, this junk looks useful. <laughs> hmm, I could use some more. More crap, please. Now it kind of pops off in this room. 16 shots? Oh no, how do I only have... Hold on, we're not out of the woods yet. Because I still haven't slept yet. I die in here, we go all the way back to the beginning of the glowing sea. Fourteen rounds left. Oh, you thought you were shifty. No, 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 I'm too slow. Broke my arm. Uh, shoot. <laughs> okay, this is not great. I almost feel like I'd be safer at this point if I just left the Sentinel site and ran straight towards Virgil's place. But that would be quitting. And I'm not a quitter. I'm a coward, but I'm not a quitter. Potato crisps and razor grain. No health. Damn. I just sated my hunger. Nice save. You could eat some raw mole rat meat right now for some health. I've got enough. Ooh, yes. It's not a lot, but it's something. I have enough bandwidth to maybe eat two. Two hits, I think, is what I can take from a feral ghoul. And then I'm toast. Bunch of them in this hallway. One at a time. We gotta go one target at a time. Go. Reload, reload, reload. We have time. Holy shit! I got lucky. I got lucky there. I was trying to just do my best to cancel his animation. I somehow canceled my own and was able to fire faster. Let me try something. Can you? You can somewhat interrupt it. You can interrupt your next shot with a melee. Slip and fall. Ten millimeter. Just what I needed. Get him to run and jump. Don't want to get too close. They run and jump and somersault. Oh, he's stuck. That's a stalker as well. Possibly could have one-tapped. I'm doing all this with a broken arm. I don't want anybody saying that I'm not a real Iron Man. I am Iron Man. I just found my bed and now take a quick nap. 
Proper sleep is good for me. But I slept too long and now I have to pee. I'm going to go 5.5 .5 on the jingle scale, the jingle rating scale there. But I think this is like a, it's like a strong 5.5. Five. Corn, we got corn. No bobby pins. Oh, and you, and once again, I am struck by the punishment of not having bobby pins. Don't have any bobby pins. That's just so strange how it, it works out like that. Who could have ever thought? For me, it was a four out of 10. Okay, well, we don't go off of your scale. If it was the trash bag of holding scale, then I would have said this gets a confirmed trash bag of holding score on the jingle scale of four out of 10. But no, it's my scale. My, my scale. Thanks for the recent Skyrim video, fun watch. I'm glad you enjoyed it. I don't think it's my favorite uh, that we've done, mainly because the video itself is essentially um, a long-winded excuse to just say, let's play modded Skyrim. But I did really enjoy it and had a lot of fun. And I think it's an awesome way to play the game. Stalker. You know what? I don't care. I don't care. I already got my checkpoint. I'm basically safe. Dodged. Fuck you. Oh, I'm so good. Just so good. I'm so good at uh, bamboozling the limited AI of the creation engine. Ah, I knew it. I knew I shouldn't. As soon as I start, you know, getting cocky, it's right when I catch a right hook every time. I'm not good. In fact, I was talking to my mom about this the other day, and I was like, I was like, mom, you know, I'm, you know, I'm actually not good at the games I play, right? Like, I'm not. I'm not necessarily a good gamer, but if something cool does happen, I think I have a decent ability of pointing out what made it cool. Okay, I'm not falling for it. Legendary. Focus on the roamer first, but a legendary is a bit scary. Their movement's going to be limited by this little block. Where'd he go? Where is the legendary? Can I carry that? Three pounds? Yeah. Almost out of here. There's a really tanky glowing one. Either in here or, yeah, in the elevator. I don't know if we can kill it. Twenty bullets? Twenty bullets won't be enough, will it? Hold on, maybe I can stay hidden and get a sneak attack on him. Maybe he won't see me right away. Ah, he doesn't. And he's not legendary. So we can probably go for a sneak attack on his leg. Yikes. Yikes! Need awkward things in his way. Ah. Oh God. Woo! Good dodge. 
There's another one in here. How in the fuck do you keep missing, dude? Oh my lord! Come on, that leg's gotta go. I think we got the leg. <sighs> when the hell did this just become Resident Evil? That's what this has felt like. That was the dumbest thing I could have possibly done. Put myself in range. There we go. Dungeon complete. Now we're out of here. We're off to go get our friend. Uh, Virgil? Virgin? More, more like, more like virgin, dude. Am I right? <laughs> more like verge. Thank you, kind sir. What are you doing out here all lonely in the glowing sea? Honestly, Virgil lives my life. Hangs out in a cave, away from society. Keeps his head down. Ooh, this takes me outside. We don't like that. We don't like that. Okay, so now as we get out of here, we'll go. We'll pop one rad X. South. To my right, there's going to be two massive ghoul encounters, um, and one massive ghoul encounter, and then a ton of rad scorpions over here. There's about three or four of them to my left, and there's the big party of ghouls. Uh, see, I told you, I have good knowledge about the glowing sea. You cannot go that way. You cannot. Fuck you, I can't go that way. I know where I'm going. I've been here before. Do you know who I am? Do you know who I am, glowing sea? I made you. I made you. You don't know. You did not make me. No, no. Okay, fuck. Reaver? I need my sprint back. Oh, this is really bad. Rocks. Get rocks in their way. Rocks in their way. Something flying, something flying and goopy. They're killing each other. Yes, yes. Cannibalize each other. How did I miss it? Where did I go wrong? Cave. Find Virgil in the glowing sea. This is just going to take me to the children of Adam. That's not going to work. He's down here. I have to keep heading west. I went the wrong way. How many times have I died in the glowing sea? I want you to guess how many times I've died in the glowing sea. Big, fat goose egg. Zero. You know why? Because I know this place like the back of my ass. You cannot go... Okay. <laughs> it was funny the first time. Glowing sea. But, uh, you know, this whole you cannot go that way nonsense. What are we doing here? Can't go that way. I'm, I'm stunned. I thought we'd be there for sure by now. Red X is going to wear off soon. We probably have another 15 or so seconds left of it. It's, I'm going right to the children of Adam. No, I'm not. Wait a minute. The children of Adam, it's directly south of them. I remember when we ran from the children of Adam to Virgil's cave. There's going to be a Deathclaw sleeping right in front of Virgil's cave. It's a scripted Deathclaw encounter. There it is. We got the cave on the map. Target spotted. Let's save up our sprint until the Deathclaw pops out.
How will we avoid legendary deathclaw? Oh, we will. You ever hold in a bong toke for so long you forget to exhale? What is that? Radiation? Uh, no, but it wouldn't surprise me how many of my chatters have held in a bong rip for upwards of five minutes. There he is. Okay, Deathclaw's awake. Where's the entrance? Where's the entrance? Where's the entrance? We have arrived. Rad free. Pretty sure there's a bed in here. Hold it. Take it nice and slow. No sudden moves. I know you're from the Institute. So where's Kellogg? Huh? Trying to sneak up on me while you distract me? It's not going to work. The only thing distracting here, Virgil, is your low res texturing. I'm not really sure what happened to, to Virgil when he was getting put together. You're gonna end up just as dead if you don't give me what I want. Dead. He's dead. Don't you lie to me. Is it so? Thank you, kind sir. Of course it is. Kellogg was ruthless. MV, thank you for the prime. The reason the Institute used him to do their dirty work for so many years. I knew they'd send him after me. Tried to prepare for it. But I still wasn't sure I'd make it. And so you, you killed him, eh? Yeah, pretty easily. What do you want with Honestly, me? kicked his ass. I showed him who the real... What even was he, a courser? I showed him who the real courser is. I'm not an idiot. I know you were part of the Institute. How could you possibly know that? No, it doesn't matter. I'm not going back. I can't go back. Look at me. Why are you even here? What do you want? Look at me. All the other super mutants have full 4K modeling. I've been left muddy and gloopy and sad. Relax. I just need to know how to get in there. Wait, what? Are you serious? Do you want to get into the Institute? Are you insane? Never mind how nearly impossible that is. Even if you were to succeed, it'd almost certainly end in your immediate death. What reason could you possibly have for taking that kind of risk? I'm trying to find my son. The Institute kidnapped oh. him. Oh no. I had no idea. I'm That's sorry. right, Burge. Yeah. The Institute is taking Getting a lot of Burge energy out of this past. guy. If your son is one of them, I can understand why you'd want to get in there. I can help, but I'm going to need something in return. No. Not a chance. No. <laughs> nope. For you. And I'm afraid I can't do anything for you. Good luck finding your way back to wherever you're Alright, fine. Going. What do you need me to do? What do you need me to do? I, I I'm only interested in blowing up the Pred one. Hey Virgil. What? I need your help. My help. With Right. Don't change the subject. I'm the one asking questions here. Yeah, take command of the conversation back. The I want to the know Institute. Now. What makes you think I know anything about the Institute? What do you mean? We just had this entire conversation. I'm not an idiot. How could you pop? No. Why are you? Relax. Wait, what? Uh -huh. You want to? Never mind. What we? Mm -hmm. I'm trying to find my. Okay, I just have uh -huh. to go through all of this again. Yeah. Uh -huh. If your son is one of sure. I can. Mm -hmm. You help me, and I'll help you. All right. If I, it could work. I th uh -huh. all right. Let first things first. Yeah, the you. Well, well, it's commonly deem molecular like relay, dematerializing, sure. tons, That's lots, and stuff. Uh, let's go. Just point me in. The well, it's him. Now I, you will go. Okay, let's get to work. Right. Uh -huh. The primary ins. Now, would you follow? Not good. I. Oh, this is going to be tough. We have to go to the CIT ruins and 
kill and institute coarser, right? I'm gonna take toughness again. Can I sleep in here? Yikes, I can't. All right, the fastest route for me getting a checkpoint is easily hitting Sentinel site, saving my game in the basement so that we can at least get a checkpoint and not have to redo all of this again. So the pressure's really on right now. Then we go from Sentinel site back to the edge of the glowing sea and we're kind of home free at that point. I need to check if he has any water. Need to do it quickly though. I'm losing time. Bingo. You find a course, or don't underestimate it. The ship's no good if you're dead. One purified water. I'll take that. That's perfect. Go. I have one rad X. Damn, do I use my rad X now? No, I think I use my rad X. I only have raw mole rat meat. Gotta go for it. We gotta try something. Okay, Deathclaw is awake. Let's just take the rocks. Oh shit, this goes right into his path. Get rocks in his way. He shouldn't follow us if we stay on the rocks. <clears throat> okay. East. I need to make sure that we're going the perfect direction. Straight shot east. The right away is at least negating the radiation that we're taking on. So it's almost better that the right away does a slow application in survival for us. Or maybe not. It at least gives me the illusion of progress. It's like waiting in line. Is there a mod list for this run? I don't have a mod list mainly because I'm really not using that many mods. Only a few small tweaks. Uh, but the main mod that we're using is Crafting Mastery. That's the mod that allows us to craft every single piece of armor and every weapon. Thought I heard something. Terrifying out here. I'm waiting for a rad scorpion to just poof, right out of the ground. Stingwing? Fuck stingwings. Oh, fuck you. Try and take the rocks to get in his way. He's right behind me. I think the rocks might have worked. Stay in his path. Keep your wits about you, Jacques. We about broke even. The Radaway that we spent and then the Rads that we accrued after the Radaway was gone. It was about a 50-50 split. But I'm glad we saved our Rad-X. Now we can use the one Rad-X, now two Rad-X. We can use the one that we found 
to get us out back to the edge of the glowing sea. Uh, MV, thank you for the prime. I'm sorry I missed that. That was a while ago. Thank you guys and Jew for keeping me company on this cold evening. Hunker down, playing my roles. We're going to be here for a while today. Happy we could be there for you. This is going to be annoying and backtracky. But I'm not going to take the second utility elevator out of here because I don't like where the door exits. I feel like the back door exit to this place leads you right into a hotbed of just encounter mayhem. Can I drink out of the toilet? Why can I not drink out of any of the toilets? That's it. IRL radiation is so scary. Yes. Yeah, no, radiation is uh, not something to fuck around with. Flip school. I'm staying up all night. That's what I'm talking about. Frick school. Abandon your studies. Hang out on Twitch streams. Forgo your important obligations. Don't pay your taxes. <laughs> actually, no, I'm in the middle of doing that right now. I, I need to... That's actually a big priority for me. For the next couple weeks, getting my taxes and whatnot figured out. I found uranium or IRL. Where? What were you doing? Do we have any geologists in chat? Shout out to all my geo fam. Where y'all at? Where's my molecular scientists at in chat? You are famished from a lack of food. Yeah, but I'm damn near invincible when it comes to radiation. Was that the Pridwin? It flashed for like a half second. No, I would not have seen the Pridwin. I'm not even looking at the right angle of it. Let's keep our sprint as much as we can in case of emergency. This is a nice little loot dungeon here. It's short. It's going to have a withered feral ghoul. Oh, hey, and it's going to be guarded by two rad scorpions. Fuck, he found me. Okay, rad scorpion got me. Do I have a critical? Not even close. Thankfully, vans can lead me out of the glowing sea. Yeah, they're right behind me. I don't have a melee weapon either. I know how to block them and time their attacks. I bot. God, Jesus. Huh? Right behind me. It squealed, though. I feel like that squeal typically only happens if they're dead. Because we have seen before in the glowing sea, we have confirmed video footage of a rad scorpion going under and then shooting directly straight up into the air and dying. So it wouldn't be the first time. Wrap around the death claw right there, unnoticed, sly. Slip right on through. Like a like a doctor's needle. Just surgically right through the glowing sea. Like an ingrown hair, it just slides right out. Ah, oh, this bastard's still following me. Two of them following me. Okay, they're getting really close. Let's throw some walls in their way. I don't have sprint. Oh, he's really fucking close! Two more in front. There's gonna be four on me. Ah, oh, God, these two are on me now. Let's try these rocks. Ha! Ka! I need to get on the roof of the church. The XP is nice, but I just need survival. Oh, 
Got to avoid the vault. It's full of gunners and an assault tron. They're going to pop up again. The red scorpions always pop up again. They never quit. There he is. You hear that? There he is. We're almost out. Two more red scorpions, I think, right here. Come on. This is just for personal pride. I want to get in and out of here. No deaths. It's not going to let me sleep in the bed. It's going to say enemies are nearby. I knew it. You cannot sleep while taking radiation damage. Piss off. I already slept in this bed. Okay, the radiation damage is gone. Maybe there's a window. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Can't get back to the bed. Okay, if I have to forego the bed, then the next closest place I can go to sleep is right on this bridge. What are you going to do if Skyrim 2 fixes path? Wait, what do you mean? Oh, it, oh, if, if like a Skyrim 2 was actually made and I couldn't cheese the enemy pathing around rocks. Okay, now is this vertebrate going to randomly go hostile again? <gasps> no way! Oh my god! God, really? Now? Of all times? Don't shoot at me. Don't, 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 don't. Like, let's not do that thing where you just randomly become hostile. Legendary Raider? Oh, that helicopter's going down. <laughs> See, this is why the Brotherhood of Steel are inferior Iron Men. They have military technology. A souped-up aircraft with chain guns, miniguns, explosives. And a couple of Raiders with wood sticks and pipe rifles. That's what's going to take them out. Look, there it goes. There it goes. Oh, no, it's still fighting. He's got a chance. He's hanging on for dear life. I shouldn't be watching this. Oh God, one of them fell. One of them got shot out the side. That'll spell the end of that helicopter. Something's right behind me. Ah, there it goes. It's kind of pretty all the way in the background. And it covers my bed with roaches. made it no deaths no deaths no meds and we made it through the glowing sea shout out to my haters you motivated me you you kept me going i pushed through the glowing sea because of you thank you kind sir working outside freezing my tushy off but i always got time to renew my sub keep on juving juve brothers what are you, uh, what are you doing outside for work? Shoveling? Snow blowing? Either way, I appreciate it. Thank you for hanging out. And for hanging out while working out in the snow. See, that's the difference between my chat and other chats. My chat weathers the storm. They'll watch during hurricanes. <laughs> no, please, if you are ever in danger, do not watch this stream. Unless it's like, it's something you can't really get out of and 
keeps your mind off shit and like sure absolutely like if there's something you can actively be doing to avoid being in a bad weather situation oh there's so many of these they're just annoying they're like sting wings but with min mini guns and techno fash bootlickers all up inside look at these look at these pricks I'm actively getting myself way more hyped up to blow up the Pridwin every time I see one of these helicopters. I forgot how, like, they just are all over the map. I do really like that about Fallout 4, that I, I never get to experience that part of it very much because we don't often go through the whole main story. But the open world sandbox as you're just casually exploring around, it changes quite often and like new elements are kind of thrown into it as you progress through the game. Like obviously you'll find higher leveled and more varied raiders. Shoot, where's Diamond City? But then you've got Automatron, which is a little overtuned. The random encounters with Automatron are, there's a, there's a little bit too many robots. But then you got the Vertibirds. Sure, there's probably a couple other things. Like earlier in the stream, we saw some Brotherhood of Steel in downtown fighting super mutants. God damn, man, you're huge. I hate the legendary rad roach. Is that a new thing? Have they always been that large? I can't believe it's been 10 hours either. This has gone by really quickly. Am I too old to watch this stream? I got served an ad for Optimus Prime Scooter, ages six to 12. That's kind of strange. If the ads on Twitch are done in any way similar to YouTube, and if the audience I have on YouTube, which I, I assume the audience I have on Twitch is, is slightly older than on YouTube. But still, it's only like maybe 10% of my audience that's under 18. It's not very many. And I like to unofficially say like it's mostly an 18 plus community. Right? Like I could see I could see myself at 15 or 16 coming across my channel and enjoying it. Get up. Dwellers in those He's like, what's with you taking me off me off the cooking station? I was having a good time on the station. It's my time for the stew. Mom said it's my turn on the cooking pot. Mama Murphy said it's my turn on the cooking pot. Get off. Sheesh, we really don't have much food. I don't need sleep. Ah, doctor. Doctor's in bed. We'll get some sleep. We'll visit the doctor. Should we just try and keep it rolling? And just go to CIT with what we have? I only have a revolver. I really don't have a lot. But I kind of do want to keep seeing how far I can go with just these weapons. And like this really limited armor. Hey, you fiend. Tell me if you need a room, otherwise the bar is over there. Here's your cap. Room two is yours. I say let's do it. Wait, hold on, hold on. Back to the Optimus Prime scooter. I think that that sounds really cool. Like, no matter your age, I think if you have an Optimus Prime scooter, that would be sick. I have a, I have a neighbor right next door to me. Uh, he's pretty chill. We've had, you know, neighborly small talk. 
like an episode of King of the Hill, uh, just back and forth. Not not as like parodical. Is that a word? Not as not as not as parody as King of the Hill is for neighborly talk. But I'm pretty beat up. We we've had a few conversations in passing as like I catch him out grilling or something like that. Super nice neighbor. Uh, if I caught him shredding on an Optimus Prime scooter, because I've seen him skateboard before. If I caught him on an Optimus Prime scooter, my respect would skyrocket. And I'd be like, whoa, 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 that is cool. I don't know much about it, but it's it's cool. I'm not even into Transformers or scootering, but if you combine the two, I think they make each other cooler. Very Midwestern, yeah. Yeah, it's very Midwestern. So I've got one neighbor that's super cool and another neighbor who I haven't really chatted at all with who has a teenager that likes to sneak out and climb on the roof directly outside my window when sneaking back inside. Note to people out there, if you live in a unit with a shared roof, make sure that your child is not sneaking back in on the roof. Oh, and by the way, I know what I'm gonna do. Okay, just so I can prove this story to you all about the person on my roof, I am going to, because it's snowing, right? So it's been snowing recently. If there's snow on the roof and he does it again, I'll be able to see the footsteps in the roof. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna see if it, if it ever happens again, I'm gonna see if I can get a picture for y'all and show you. I'm not gonna live stream it. Patch me. Go over your. Took a few bad hits recently. Scrape. Like Santa. <laughs> Anything else bothering you? Just cosplay as the roof. No other complaints. Take better care of yourself in the future. I'm not that big. Hey, I'm still like 30 pounds lighter than I was a year ago. Although I need to get back on a program I was doing recently because I have started to put a couple back on. Uh, but anyway, yeah, Optimus Prime scooter. That shit's tight as hell. Ah, oh, crap. Why did I not cure my radiation? Ugh. Gotta go back in. It's because you guys distract me with the... You guys distract me with the Optimus Prime scooter and... Telling the same damn story. That looks really pretty. Is 30 pounds like one kilogram? I am not sure. Don't dally. If you're here to be examined, let's get you... My favorite part of Fallout 4 is how the skip dialogue button is the exact same as the shoot your gun button. And there's always this weird thought of, do I really want to risk skipping the dialogue on the off chance yeah. I accidentally blast my doctor in the face? I think I soaked up blood pool. All done. Any other complaints? That was it. Off you go then. But yeah, at my heaviest last year, I was like, um, 235, no, 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 not 235, uh, 225. When I hit 225, that's when I was like, okay, I need to alter this. So that's when I got the standing desk and the treadmill. And then I did keto pretty hardcore for a while. I haven't done keto in a while. I need, I, I do want to do it again because I feel really good when I'm doing it. But also at the same time, you know, you're taking a pretty important Everything part outside the wall. of your diet out in carbs. So, you know, I don't think I could ever do it like forever. Carbs are wonderful. Croissants and donuts and sandwiches and burgers and fries and oh, God, everything wonderful contains carbs. Everything. Everything that I love and hold dear. There's probably a carb involved. 
I guess Skyrim is technically carb free. But if you're playing these games in the optimal setting, sitting there, stoned, with a snack, a warm blanket, rainy or snowy weather outside your window, that's the optimal setting to play a Bethesda game in. And if you're doing that, then it's technically not carb free. So I'm a, I'm a bit mixed. Doing it one week at a time. Yeah, that's uh, that's kind of how I've done it over the last like nine ish months. I'll do it for like a week and I'll take a bit of a break. I don't know. There's probably some kind of what is it, like carb cycling. It's probably a word for it. And honestly, at the end of the day, it just limits how many calories you take in. If you're limiting your bread and stuff like that. OK, no more diet talk, right? This is this is fucking serious. I need to get through CIT with a pipe revolver in one life. And I think we're going to do it. Horse or signal. Oh, damn it. I wish I wish I had the speed running experience that Jabo has, because then I would know exactly where he is. But I have no fucking clue where he's at. I assume he's inside. Maybe we take can we take the upstairs here? I'd rather have the high ground. No, it's not even it's not even fully textured in here. Maybe we can still get on the roof, though. Ooh, can I hit that? I think I can get on that little lip. Do I have any jet? Oh, crap. Oh, no way. I just blew that. Now I'm thirsty. I should have tried to jump on this one. Or this one. There's so many better options. I'm sorry. Sorry I failed you all. Let's go inside. CIT Rotunda. Rotunda kind of sounds like a dish. All right, it's super mutants versus synths. I should probably be on the side of the synths at the start of the battle. Or maybe I take no sides and just let them punch each other. They're going to weaken each other enough to where I can maybe get involved. Sounds like they're done punching. How the hell do I get upstairs? Although I'm not getting the synth coarser radio signal anymore. Oh, it's at zero. I was getting some of it while I was in the courtyard. Maybe I just need to pass through this place again, hit a different door and see what the percentage is. to go back to the courtyard it looks like the percentage was getting higher as i went to the east side of the building 36 flares oh cheat cheating 
I thought I was disarming it. I get a pass there. I thought I was disarming it. Don't go nuts. Don't freak out at me. I'm going to I'm going the right way. I'll figure it out. I got this. I'm a big boy. All right, so if it's not indoors and I get cut off going that way, probably have to go this way. Why is my health so low? Twenty three point three six thirty. It's going to get chaotic. Thirty eight. Still staying at thirty eight. Now it's going down. Someone's over here to my right. There they go. Oh, this quest is going to take us through so many raider hotspots. One of them just opened up the gate right there. They're going to come around the road right here, probably. No sign of them now. I should have invested in a silencer. Come, ah. come on, come on, come on. I got this one hit. There's a second one shooting at me. That was cool. That was very cool. I just have to point that out. That that was fucking badass. Just so just so that if I die here, I can still at least claim that that was in fact dope. That was a really bad miss. Two of them in front. Grenade. I'm a god. Good timing. I'm a god. A grand and intoxicating innocence. Come on. God. Oh, bring it on, bring it on, guard. bitches. Where you at? You, Playing games with me, huh? This is like a western. I love this. I think one of them is going to try to push around that corner, so I should probably go around here to the left. Mayhem, thank you so much for gifting five to the channel. It's your support that allows me to continue doing st stupid things in these games. Sorry, I have hiccups right now. Bad miss again. Bad miss again, and they have a precision weapon, so if they get close, they'll do really good damage. Get around the rocks! Oh, piss off with the Molotovs. How does that one hit me? No way! Get the fuck out of here! Oh my gosh. You are joking. God. How can you kill a god? What a grand and intoxicating innocence. I'm a god. Let's see how bad how it can gets. You kill a god. Shame on you, sweet man of our. Ink Demon. You are very kind as well. I appreciate you. Thank you for gifting five to the channel. Here we go. Let's see if it's a bad one. You know what? Uh, time out, time out, time out. Time out, time out, time out. You know what? This is an Iron Man run. This is an Iron Man run. Let's get rid of... Let's get rid of that one. Let's get rid of safe. Right. There's enough... There's enough safety in the spins so far. So I'm getting rid of it. 
I don't need a safe spot. I don't need to get my special stats back. I'm going to be fine. I'm a god. How can you kill a god? What a grand and intoxicating it is. I'm a god. Not bad. How can you kill a god? Shame I'm going to say it right now. I'm gonna say it right now. I don't think the dropping junk right now is bad. Annoying, yes, but bad? I don't know about. Well, I, uh, I, I, it's not great. It's not great. It's, oh god, yeah, it's not great. Oh. Oh. Fuck, I have to load my save. <laughs> I loaded the wrong save. Can I can I take this checkpoint? Will you allow me to take this checkpoint, chat? Or do I have to make the run from Diamond City back here? I'm okay with that. Allowed? Okay, all right, all right, all right, allowed. We'll allow it, we'll allow it. I'm okay with that. I feel so light and freed up. I have so much range of motion and agility, flexibility. You know, I can wiggle around and move. And dance. You know? Just dropped one of the biggest loads I've ever seen without mods. Yeah. What's up, Virgil the Virgin? That's how you drop loads. You learn something or two from me. Time out. Nice shot. Incredible. Nice. Just awesome. Yeah, great work. Let's just take a Molotov to the face. Christ. Oh. The only thing saving me right now is the fact that shotguns on survival are just useless from range. How does that not... I mean, this is just so disastrous compared to the last attempt in this fight. You're thirsty. You're thir You know what? Fine. I'm thirsty. Let's get a drink. Quit crying. Still parched. Anybody in chat who lives in Boston, I need you to run out to the Boston River right now. Uh, take a few swigs. Let me know how many swigs it takes for you to feel not thirsty anymore. That was a great shot. That was just fantastic aim. 52%. 57. Meyer lurks in front. Can we get a sneak attack on the face? Just have to hit two more shots to the face. Missed. 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 Whew, those legs. Masterful gambit, Nate. This game. Give me your meat 
and the rubber. Don't hold back. I need junk. Uh, 31 bullets. Is that enough to kill the synth courser? I'm gonna have to stealth my way the rest. Yeah, I'm gonna have to stealth the rest of the way there. This is the weirdest episode of Johnny Bravo I've ever seen. To be fair, scooping water with your hand isn't that much. I did think about that. And you know what? You are right. Uh, I assume he's all the way up in this really tall tower. Fallout 4 tends to like to put strong enemies at the top of really tall towers. Eighty-five. 87 90 Yeah, he's definitely in green tech Haven't done this dungeon on the channel So I've got no clue what to expect in here. I'm gonna assume a lot of synths Probably much more than 30 bullets can take out Let's just hope we find some ammo in here There's dead gunners, we have a good shot. Oh, for one. Need to find dead bodies. Or an ammo box. Something. See, this is why this is where I need Alan Wake's power. I need to write myself some ammo into the script. Once again, please play Alan Wake if you haven't. You're doing Iron Man mode and I'm playing RuneScape. Welcome to any uh, RuneScapers in the chat. If there's anybody with RuneScape on one monitor and this stream on the other monitor, I'd like to give a shout out to all my grinders out. On the second floor. Kill on sight. Send reinforcements to the lobby in case there are more. Reinforcements to the lobby. Does that mean gunners inbound? Oh, God, that just scared me. Danger. Who sees me? Got around the far side of the hallway. I had a good shot there. Rocket launchers? Okay, this is not good. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I've never seen a computer... Uh-oh. I'm dead. I'm dead. I don't stand a chance. Wow. Wow. That was brutal. That was really brutal. I mean, that was... Uh, this is going to be tough. Yeah, we got our work cut out for us. Yeah, I got to do this again. I think we have the death count right. It should have just updated by one. I know we're going to spin the wheel. I just. I need to prepare myself because I'm losing all of my junk. If I lose my weapons. That's going to be a setback for us. So I need to prepare myself for a really bad loss. Okay, that's not too bad. I'll pay up. I'll pay up. I'll pay up. That, that, that does suck. But it's also like, okay, okay, all right. I would rather pay for an advantage in game. And <laughs> give some subs to you all then lose everything right now. That would be bad. That would be brutal. 
Uh, give me one sec. There's a, there's like a specific way I have to do it in order for it to work. Uh, da, 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 da. I think I just go to my do I just go to yeah I just go to twitch.tv slash juve so then I have to sit here and both hear myself on the stream it's a really it's, it's weird it's weird like right now I am looking at myself and like I'm a god. it's just weird how it plays out kill a god. what a grand and intoxicating innocence I'm a god can you I can celebrate not losing any more junk. So the gunners are going to have several melee enemies. They're going to have people shooting off lasers. I'm going down in one, maybe two shots. No 10 millimeter rounds. What is the best course of action? I got an idea, and I don't think that any of you are going to like it. I'm going to try again. Because now I have, the, I have the advanced knowledge. I know where the enemy's at. I know where the first detection is going to come from. But I also need to move fast enough so that I can clear out that first encounter and remove myself from the encounter before the fight upstairs finishes if the fight upstairs finishes and i haven't taken out my targets then that puts me in a position where they could all aggro to me upon finishing their fight whereas if i kill my two targets and they're still engaged with another enemy it's gonna be easier to escape out of the problem Sorry. Sorry about that. Craft some... Ugh, I should make some landmines. This guy's not gonna follow me in, right? Oh my god, he followed me in! You gotta be kidding me! Uh, barrier? He's too big for the door. Oh, they both followed me in! Oh, wonderful! They're too big for the door, though. Right, the danger right now is because of the Meyer Lurks. If we keep them in the lobby, we could use them to our advantage. There's gonna be one enemy right here on the corner of this door. Two in the hallway, there's one. They already see me. We damaged the one with the gun. So let's see if we can somehow fall back and aggro them onto the Meyer Lurks. I really doubt that. But perhaps keeping them in this hallway gives us some kind of advantage. Fully auto. Oh, they made it. They made it up here. Now they're up top. Fight each other. Fight each other. They have to start fighting each other, right? Oh, this is so bad. Why don't I hear any? Where's all the? The Myrlurks are up there. Why would you not fight the gunner? Oh, they're fighting the gunner now. Okay, uh, behind the desk. Now they're fighting each other. Shit, the gunner's down. Or the Meyer Lurk's down. Lock 
Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. No, he's up top. That's so tough. That's so unbelievably tough. I feel like we played that correctly. All right, we'll spin the wheel. And just pray that it doesn't land on drop everything. Yeah, uh, drop weapons and drop everything right now would both really suck. All right, we really need to stop dying. We really need to stop. What's my special item? So we can lose one strength, one endurance, intelligence, or agility. So one, two, three, four. Okay, we can lose one of four. I'm just gonna do a random number generator. One through four. It was two. Again, it was two again. I can prove it. I will prove it. Boom, right there. Random number generator. Landed on two. Just so. Just so we're keeping it honest. So, oh, God damn it, that means endurance has to go down. So we gotta set endurance to six. That means we have slightly less sprint. We need to get ammo. Also, I need to get my companion. I don't know why I keep trying to go it alone. I'm gonna run to Diamond City, fast travel to Red Rocket, let's get our bearings back, let's not die, let's load back up a little bit. You know, restock, reload. Then we'll be okay. And yes, I just did go to scratch the top of my ass. Brilliant. Masterful play. Walk right into the bandit camp. We do need to craft ammo, but the unfortunate thing is I had to drop all of my junk. Go grab Hancock. Do we have to complete a quest for Hancock? Because I'd rather, because of the time and how long this is actually going to end up taking, I'd rather just stick to the main story for now. Uh, so for unessential a follower Diamond City I just changed it to try and not break the main story where if we land on that and I have a follower That follower I just have to dismiss them immediately. So like if they go down, they just gotta go They gotta they gotta go away for a little bit I really don't remember what happened to Piper. I think we broke up with Piper to take Nick with us not much I can really do while I'm in town here. Yeah, it's true. Do I have any money? Yeah, we still have 80 caps. So I'm gonna drink more mud water. Oh, wait a minute. No, what am I doing? Don't drink the water. I region locked Diamond City a long ass time ago, but I remember that this stupid kid. Yeah, this stupid scam artist right here. He's got all the purified water that we need. Got it. Break into this little dirtbag's house. And he's got a bunch of sugar bombs. Guilt free food. I I guess. There's a little bit of guilt if you feel bad about stealing from a child, but this is the apocalypse. I got to survive too. Pure water right here. That'll do for now. Let's head back to Red Rocket, grab McCready. 
McCready's gonna know how to handle gunners. Ooh, but he's not wearing a cool outfit. I wonder where McCready is. I do like Preston's outfit. Maybe we should bring Preston with again. No, we can't. Preston's technically dead. Where is Creedy? Oh, Creedy, where are you? Apparently there's only two people here. But I could have sworn when McCready went away, he said, or it said up in the top left, it said uh, McCready is heading back to Red Rocket Truck Stop. Did I make an ammo workbench? Oh, I'm not going to be able to make anything right now. Time, sir. Juve, juve, juve off. How did it pronounce the fourth one so wrong? Enbit, thank you for half a year. All right, Piper. Hey, Piper. You're back in. Heading my way? Sure, let's go. Will do. Our relationship got a little bit rocky. I will admit that. But overall, Piper was fairly affected. Where's the deliverer? It's out of ammo. I don't have any ammo. What are you building? Ah, okay, so we do have the ammo workbench. I need copper, lead, and steel. Uh, well, the good news is we have scrapper rank one, and I do have some legendaries to scrap. I believe I have two. <gasps> oh, I got rid of them. Okay, we have two pieces of armor we can break down. So metal right leg and metal right arm. Metal right leg and metal right arm. There's two metal right arm. Five three six C three two. We don't have an actual armorer's workbench, do we? <gasps> yes. So much for scrapper. That didn't give me shit. Ah, oh, what were you hiding? So no copper, no lead. That's actually a huge bummer. We struck out there pretty badly. Don't have much money. 80 caps, it's not going to get me very much ammo. So what do we do in the meantime? Annoying. Uh, oh, oh, who is that? Settler. Super mutant. How? Lou, we're not alone. Yeah, I know we're not alone. Open fire. Oh my god. Maybe this works out in our favor. I knew I set up our defenses properly. Look at that, look at that expert gate placement. He didn't even help. 
I'm kind of mad at that guy. What, does he think I'm just gonna let him into Sanctuary because he didn't help? <clears throat> no ammo. I need to assign someone to this. So we got no ammo there. Oh, I have an idea. This could work. What if we go from here? Because fast travel to Abernathy. Fast travel to Abernathy is allowed. <clears throat> Why don't we hit Abernathy Farm? Seems to be growing well. Take all their potatoes. All their potatoes. They can't do nothing about it. All right, now that we've decimated their crops, I think they have some melons in the back. Let's hit those melons. I need to assign someone to this. I need to assign someone to this. Probably nothing I can cook with potatoes. Where is the one gal here who sells stuff? Is it Lucy? Is that her name? No. Connie? Where are they? Connie, you home? Blake. Connie. Hey. Blake told me what you did for us. For Mary. I know it's not. Sounds good. She doesn't have any money at all. Or perhaps we can go all the melons. And all the taters. That's an easy hundred caps. Again, not that much for our ammo. But it could help. I need to do one quick pass through some of the lower level areas. Kill a few enemies. Let's check uh, Treaty and Patrick's place. There's usually some bandits hanging around there. Kill them. Take uh, Check Trudy's inventory. Maybe get some 10 millimeter rounds. But we're really light. Is this a random event? I don't recognize this fridge. Nice. Did I say I, I would allow looting weapons from locked containers? If we can scrap them. That's what I thought. Because I've really only found maybe two in total. They're the only like non-legendary weapons that I actually can loot. So that could get us some copper. Perhaps I could buy lead. Yeah, yeah, we need steel, lead, copper. That's it. We really don't need a lot to craft our own ammo. My focus should be on crafting ammo. So let's check out Trudy's. Doesn't sound like there's a gunfight. Carlos here. I'd rather have that than some raiders. Jim. Hey, Carla. Need to pick something up? Road's pretty long from here. I've got a few minutes to browse. Always happy to make a sale. Ten pound weight, that's lead. We'll take it. Copper. Gotta be some in here. Copper and steel. There it is. Those are expensive, though. For two copper. 
I haven't found any other lead. She doesn't have a whole lot of lead on her. Came out of there with money. That pistol we picked up did have some extra, you know, 15 bullets. That's not really that much, though. So I'm going to go back to Red Rocket. This is uneventful, so I am just going to zip over there. What are you building? Thirty bullets. Thirty ten millimeter rounds. Fifty forty five rounds. Another vertebrate in the area? Are they really encroaching on my territory? I can hear them in the distance. Oh my god, they really are encroaching on our territory. This is Minutemen lands. Go back to your little blimp. All right, I'm feeling okay here with all this. That's definitely a cheat. It's so dumb how you can just make soda. Who the fuck is making soda in the apocalypse? I would think like sweet tea would be somewhat popular if sugar was available. Uh, I think I'm just going to try it with this loadout. I mean, we're limited. We're going to get to Diamond City hungry and tired and all that nonsense again. Actually, we're just a little bit thirsty. I'm going to go for it right here. General Atomics Galleria has a boxing gym. So we'd be able to find... We'd be able to find a bunch of weights in there. Get a ton of lead. Too many miles on the road. Cricket. Got a hankering for melting face? I'm your girl. I think we're gonna do what we should be doing. See what you have. A part of every big Remember our big thing is like, let's let's take away power from the wheel. So I'm gonna buy as many of her 10 millimeter rounds as I can. 57 of them. Take ourselves down to zero caps. Now if I die here, and I have to drop all of my ammo? Whew. Ooh, maybe... Uh, actually, no. What I just did, I just gave the wheel more power. Like, significantly more power. Because now if we land on drop ammo, yeah, it's not good. Is it cold where you are? Yeah, it's pretty cold. Not like freezing, freezing cold yet, but we did get some snow. Shout out to whoever recommended gift subs to the wheel of punishment. Yeah, I'm down. I'm down 20 subs at this point. So we've hit it twice. And since I removed a couple of the winning options. Then just don't die. Oh, I'm not. Get up to full health. We're back at CIT. I'm going to give myself a checkpoint here just to sort of cut back on the backtracking a little bit. Because that kind of backtracking does... Oh man, it gets boring.
We go that way, we hit Raiders. We go this way, we hit Meyer Lurks. Thank you, kind sir. Missed my... Missed my pog meat? Uh, thank you, Magica. Is, is your username Magica, is it based on the resource pool in the Elder Scrolls series or on the Magicka series itself. I've never played it, but the music's great. There he is, right behind me. Uh-oh. Tree. She's gonna go down here. Oh my gosh, it's so nice having Piper here. Huh. You make my life so much easier, Piper. Let's hope this doesn't drag her into an international conflict. Come on, follow me. We're not getting involved. We throw stones and run away. It's the coward's way. Uh, blue, blue, blue butt. Thank you so much for gifting five to the channel. Sorry, I didn't really have an opportunity there to give you an old dance. But regardless, I appreciate it. It was pretty good timing, though, as I bamboozled the Mirelurk into hitting the tree and not killing me. They don't swear like mud crabs. Oh, damn it. I need to get working on recording some lines for what uh, what DDM and I want to make. Thank you, kind sir. How many deaths are we at? What does it say? Is that like 29? I can't see. For Abe Sora, thank you for the prime. Oh, I got reinforcements. Oh, there he is. Okay, I thought she was gone. What are you looking at that guy's butt for, Piper? This is not the time. This is not the time to be dancing. I I need to focus on the mission. Mayhem, I appreciate you. Thank you. Once Chip again. In. Chip in. Chip in. Shut the fuck up, Wii Sports guy. I only took one hit, but I got a few on him. This one's pushing melee. Oh my gosh, what a combo. Wait, that works really well. Piper, fall back. Hey, over here. Move here. Here. Come on, get out of, get out of gunfire. Heal up, heal up. Wait there. Let them push. But maybe get your gun out and turn around and face the door. Wrong way, Piper. Piper, turn. Go. Got it. Not going Let's go. Uh -huh. Are you shitting me? They go? Piper, get up and shoot. Here's hoping they don't come back. Brilliant play, Piper. <laughs> Amazing work, Piper. Thank you. You're a combat genius. She's the tactician. I'm just a frontline soldier in her army. How did that turret get so many shots on her? I need to figure out where that turret is. Oh, they dropped 10 millimeter. Oh, yes. They dropped 10 millimeter. There it is. 
One turret down. Okay, whew, doesn't involve me. So we were able to clear out. Oh, now we're danger? Got the turret. Oh my god, this is chaotic. Another turret down. Ooh, shout out Piper. She caught that turret before I did. Power relay, that's gonna have a copper for us. All clear, all clear. Still have 88 rounds, plenty of ammo. But if any of them upstairs Thank have rocket launchers, that. that's real trouble. Rocket launchers upstairs would probably ruin this whole thing and make me second guess the entire challenge. All right, it's getting serious now. MPI one, thank you so much for three months. Who? Thanks, chat. I really appreciate it. Piper, need you to tank for a second. Let's play it safe and get our health back. What do I have? Purified water? Works for me. Oh, that is, we're just brilliant. One in front, one over the top. Both of us can get shots on our enemy. The Corsair is now on the third floor. Reports of the second intruder in the east wing near the courtyard. I wish I didn't waste my jet earlier. Stay hidden. What? Nice. That was a huge hit. Pretty sure we got the critical there. Take a step up. Need her to be in front. What the? Oh, God, <laughs> this is terrifying. He got a shot in on me. Damn, I wish I didn't let him hit me. That hit hard. Cash, plunger, more money. See what kind of legendary we got. Keep an eye out for traps as well. Metal chess piece. I'm not, I'm, I'm not even going to pick it up. If, if it's a legendary and it's not a weapon, it's useless at this point. It's just going to scrap into steel. One down. Let's slide over so Piper can get in the room. Two down. Fifty-nine bullets left. Hopefully we can reload in here. No. Yes. I really do sound like Nate when I do that. Yes. Hey, something's out there. Not anymore. Not anymore, Piper. Don't you know who you're traveling with? Barricade. I'm the smoking gun. I'm like the average. I'm like Django. Right? All 
or any other, I don't know, it's hard. I'm, 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 I'm losing track of my spaghetti western protagonist. Also, truth be told, I haven't seen that many spaghetti western movies, so don't judge me, all right? I'm, I'm trying to be topical and, and make pop culture references, but I just can't pull them out of my brain right now because I'm stressed. Django or Django? Either one works. No, that's window dressing. NPCs don't fight like that. It's not real. But if I can take over anything in there and... Oh, man. If I can put it on my side. Deactivate system diagnostics. All we can do is deactivate. Uh, that was a dead body flying. Maybe it's not window dressing. Rocket launcher. I had to go for it. If that Molotov killed me, I may have genuinely quit. I, I may have just retired from this game in general. The only bad thing that happened there is that when we killed the guy with the rocket launcher, which that was brilliant, we should have gone for him first. I'm really glad we did. The only bad thing there is that the rocket launcher is still up on that ledge. I, ideally, I would have wanted the rocket launcher to fall down and then nobody can pick it up. Turrets are deactivated. More ammo. If I lose this gun, it's over. Or it's a, it's a major setback. <clears throat> We've lost contact with sectors two and four. I don't think we're out of the woods yet. Locked door probably, <clears throat> it's probably a safer route. Yeah, let's take the locked door route. Whew, I'm not gonna lie, chat, this is significantly more intense than I thought it would be. That's it. You sure know your way around a bobby pin. Piper, this isn't the time for flirting. All right. Am I actually dying inside? I feel like I'm going to have to burn my clothes. Oh, How do you think you are? Yes. Get out of here. Copper on the hot plate. Got to keep an eye out for lead more than anything, though. But I guess if we're fighting gunners, ammo isn't really a problem. Right up to the top, right on the stairs. Footsteps all around. I knew it. I knew it was going to try and bamboozle me like that. It was a great try. It was honestly legendary up in the corner. He's got a gun. One of them's with melee. Do they know how to get behind me? Finish him off, Piper. He got a huge hit on me there. And there's another Molotov. One Molotov kills me. Two Stimpaks left. No, 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 no! Still in danger. Come on, asshole. Fuck you. You're the one who's fighting like a coward, not me. 
I'm fighting like a brave warrior who's seen combat plenty of times. Am I right? Still above, I would assume, unless that was Piper. Yeah, he's got to still be above me. Jesus, this is like playing Warzone. I'm trying to just listen in and sense exactly where the footsteps are. Piper's down. We're back to hidden. Oh, I need to hope one of them drops a stim pack for me. No stimmies. I've only got one left. Gotta be to the right. Oh my gosh, Piper. <laughs> do not do that. At least they didn't hear it. Thought that was Piper again. Got a stim pack. All right, stim pack is pretty big right there. That saves us two. I mean, we only have two. I can't really afford to use any on Piper. Nuka. Nuka Cola's big. Turrets to my left. I can hear them through the wall, so we want to try and hit this. I bet it's advanced, though. We're near the top of the tower. I doubt they throw us a novice terminal. Should probably I should clear out this hallway first. There's the rocket launcher. Wait, no, we already turned off these turrets. Another stim pack, good find. Sorry, I'm taking it so slow in here, chat, but I really want to get through this on the first try. Thank you, kind sir. W H E R E. It's zero. One. I hate when it resets tries before doing all the duds. Think we got them all? What about skies? That's it. Hey! Sometimes intuition is all you need. Okay, we already had them deactivated, so the turrets are offline. I'd love a plasma pistol. I think if I craft another weapon, that's what I want to make, a plasma pistol. Stealth boy. Maybe I should actually make use of the stealth boy. same room we were just in. All clear, all clear. All clear, and then that leads back to where we were. Okay. Just want to double check and make sure I'm making the most use of everything in this building. Dang it. Yeah, that is not, that is not, no, I'm not buying it. That is not how NPCs in Fallout 4 fight each other. Fall back to original position. The course is nearing the elevator. Oh, damn, I had a good shot on him. Got him? Now, chat, let me just double check with all of you guys. Have I missed any beds? What was that? Fuck. Psst. 
No, no, no. Ah, uh, about got myself killed trying to give her a command. I don't think, I, I can't really think up a more frustrating way to have gone than accidentally getting into conversation with Piper and dying as a result. Kind of a waste of a stim pack, but I need to ensure that I have max health. I need to use my stealth boy. At some point, I gotta use it. There's also an animation when using it. So I need to factor that into when I decide to pull it out. God, I hate that. I like, I'm taking it so slow that the thematic fight that keeps occurring above my head is happening at a pretty unrealistic pace. I cannot lose. I can't lose. It'll br it'll <laughs> it'll break me if we die here. And I just know, I mean, we've seen Molotovs. We've seen them get thrown. We can't get cocky. It also looks like enemy de hey. I was about to say, it looks like enemy detection in here is scripted to a result, or to a degree. I can't get sucked in and aim at one enemy like that. She was about to throw a Molotov. No traps. I think that would have set off a bunch of turrets. Let's just make sure they're off. T I R E S. T I R E S. Sweet. Shut down the turrets. Gunner Private. Okay, yeah, that's it's good that I dodged and got out of there because the Gunner Private is buffed. Probably dealing really good damage to Piper right now. Probably to me if I get any closer. Gotta level up. Uh... Ooh, I really don't know which way to go. We could go sneak. We could go strong back. I feel like I should just keep piling on and either go with life giver or toughness. What do you guys think? I, I feel like a lot of people have told me that life giver is better than toughness. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna take sneak. 40% harder to detect while sneaking, and we won't set off landmines anymore. We're not clear in here, though, because it's caution. Take her out. I don't like this arena. Because I go in here, they're already on top of me. Finish him off. Come on, pipes. You held, your own there, Blue. held my own. I held yours, too. Stupid, useless spotlight mechanic that nobody understands. Does anybody in here understand how the spotlights in this game work? What do they do? Like, if you're in one, are enemies more accurate? That'd be kind of cool. If being in a spotlight buffed enemy accuracy against you, 
or if you had your own spotlight, it buffed your settler's accuracy. I need to do a double check. There's no beds in here. Not a single bed. No, not a single bed. The wiki says no beds? Damn. Okay. I'm nervous. If it opens up when we immediately go to caution, I'm throwing on the stealth boy. I have no clue what's behind the elevator. We're on hidden, but there's spotlights. I only have 48 rounds left. We're running low on ammo. Master terminal. There's got to be something big in there that activates that having level four science would stop me from facing. My guess is a sentry bot. Advanced. Don't think I can pick this. I don't like this. What is all this? What are you doing, Piper? What are you doing? Hey, 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 hey. Stay focused. Stay focused. Come on. We're almost there. We're right at the end here. Sorry, chat. At the risk of accidentally spoiling what happens in this dungeon, <clears throat> I will not look at you until I either die or complete this dungeon. Detected. I don't know the password. I'm telling the truth. I don't believe you are. Oh, God. Please, no. Please. no. <laughs> All he had to do was tell me the password. Now, are you going to cooperate? Oh, God. Oh, tell God. Me. Okay, okay. Just don't shoot. Let me think. You, I'm going to get in there. It's just a matter of time. Tell me the password. Look, you've been following me. Is he hostile? You. Come here. Are you here? What in the hell was that? I had to get separation so I could think. I had no chance to react. I thought for a second it was just going to go into some dialogue, but because of the angle of the door... Piper's out. Because of the angle of the door, I must have lost him or, or exited the conversation. And according to him, exiting the conversation, that must be some sort of hostile act against him. So he draws his weapon. Okay, all right, fine. I was gonna try to go the peaceful route. I was gonna join the Institute if it went that way, but <laughs> the game decided not to. Yeah, it's supposed to be dialogue there. So we need to get the fuck out of this situation. I think we go Stealth Boy, uh, Psycho, Medex. Fury is only melee damage, so we're gonna go, we're gonna go buff out. We're gonna go Medex. We're gonna go Psycho. We're gonna go Stealth Boy. We're going to throw all those on. Oh my gosh, I can't see. Purified water. The last one that we have. We can do decent damage to him. can't see holy shit this is insane ah he's got hits on me gotta fall back gotta fall back he's hitting way too hard he's 
following again. Got to get my health back before anything else. Thank you, quest marker. That's bullshit. Oh, I got him. Got him in the head a couple times there. 18 bullets left. Damn, he's getting health back. I'm going to run out of my stuff. Other room. Five bullets. Shit. I gotta know what his health is. Fairly low. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Got another hit on me. I gotta take a stim pack just so that I can make sure that I'm still passively healing the whole time. Pop your head. Poke your head. Oh, no. Run out of ammo, douche. Took another stim pack. Nice hit. Let's move. Down a level. He's got to follow again. That should have hit. But that's okay. We'll let him fire off his rounds. Headshot, but he smoked me. Another headshot. Another good shot. Is he going to heal again? No way! Oh, that's such... Oh my god, stop, 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 stop! I need to get my health back. I mean, this is the end of... Oh, it's the end of the line. It's literally the end of the line. This is it. Oh, I'm toast. No. No! Up the stairs. He got me again. He got me again in the back. Up the stairs. No, I don't have a stim pack. If I can find a stim pack, I can bring back Piper. Got a hit. Come on. Come on, there's gotta be a stim pack in there. Got another hit. Got him! Oh my god! <laughs> Yes! Oh my god! I thought it was over! Oh, we got him! Oh my gosh! Wow! I'm, I'm like shaking. My aim actually started to get really, really shaky at the end. Now I'm losing health because I'm dehydrated. Imagine if I die from dehydration. Okay, we got the Courser chip. Achievement. <laughs> Thank you, game. Thank you for reminding me. I have not played this enough. Wow. I mean, that was, that was really intense. We got it. We got him. What was the gamble on that? Also, uh, Hairbrain, thank you for sending your stream over. Hope your stream was wonderful. Uh, Bonusar, thank you for the prime. 
There's a, uh, probably a couple I missed in here. Uh, actually, no. We're all caught up. All right, sweet. God, I guess nobody felt generous while I was popping off. <laughs> nobody, nobody thought that was cool. He, he deserved to die. I know you're not here for me, but I can't get out. Not on my own. I'm going to have to trust you to help me. I'm not, look, I'm not gonna hurt you, okay? Mainly because I want to avoid as much combat as I can. I promise not to hurt you. I guess I don't really have a choice, do I? Looks like you've already found the password. Use uh, it to unlock the toilet. Also, for the mods, uh, mods, if you're gonna set up a gamble and you're gonna do, you know, reach X level before X amount of deaths, or you're gonna do, you know, do something before however many deaths, you always have to set the line at a half it always has to be three and a half or four and a half or five and a half whatever you're setting it at it has to have a half point in there because that way there will be a definitive winner and loser if you just set it to four then what if i die four times there's your there's your there's your lesson on uh, vegas gambling we're setting vegas lines in here not a very good line though the over under was five how many times did i die one it was phrased less than five and five or more okay i guess that works but if we're gonna gamble we gotta use gambling language we gotta set the line because it is fun it is really fun when we set the line and it's super accurate in the door well, i can't revive piper <laughs> I'm shaking. That was, whew, whew. Ah, damn, I live for these moments. I fucking live for them. This is why we play under extremely limited conditions. Because it is so goddamn fun when it works out. <laughs> I mean, if I died there, if I died to him, that would have just sucked. That, that really would have fucking stunk. Okay, I'm dying, I'm, I'm dying, dying. Do you have water? Fuck you guys, I'm, I'm quick saving <laughs> in case dehydration kills me. What, is there a toilet? Elevator's not functioning. I don't know what to say. Okay, well we need to go before I die. Good, classic, no water in the rewards chest. The terminal's got this locked. Okay, new problem. I'm thirsting to death. What does that mean? They're starving to death, but what does it mean if you don't have enough water? I'm dehydrating to death? Uh, this doesn't help me. Not fusion cores. Useless. I'll take them because they're valuable. Dying of thirst? Oh my god. Oh my gosh, I'm thirsting to death. I gotta have Nuka Cola. No Nuka. Nuka? <gasps> oh. It's gotta at least somewhat help. Yeah, you feel better, but still dehydrated. Good. We might have slowed it down just a bit. Toilet? Oh, I wanna dunk my face in the empty toilet. I don't care if I'm sucking down sewage. I want to get all up in that toilet bowl. Oh, God, don't ever do that again. Do not. No, never. No, 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 no. Sugar bombs. That's good. We need some food. I just took rat away. I just. Why? Why would I take rat away? The elevator activate from the computer whatever whatever the fuck gets me out of this building if this door opens up and there's more enemies down here i'm not ready for it
got it. Oh my god, the buff out wore out and I almost died as a result. I don't think I've ever had lower health. Come on. You can't kill me. You just can't. It's not fair. It's outrageous. Milk? What do you not have milk? Yeah, 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 I could have taken the faster way out of here. Let's risk, let's get risky. Why not? Feeling dangerous. We did not come from, we came from this way. I'm not gonna lie, y'all. Mom, I'm pretty scared. Okay, made it outside. We're free. Now I'm gonna get to the river and slug down some of that lake water. Check both ways before crossing the road. Slurp that shit. Drink like you've never drunk before. Mephodius isn't part of the charm, <laughs> like, isn't part of the charm when chat screams at a streamer nonstop, they do the exact opposite of what chat had been suggesting, and it leads to their demise. Sometimes it's fun. Although, I can't see sometimes how it might make you want to pull your hair out. <laughs> But I do think that there is, for like the challenges we do and the way I interact with these games and the way that I have fun with these games, I do think that there is an element of, okay, I need to shut all of you off right now and only operate on the information that exists in my head. Because like if I go into a dungeon that I haven't played and the one that we just went through, seven years i haven't been into that building in forever i had no clue what the layout was like so if i go into a place like that and it's kind of intense and we're trying to complete something and i look over in chat and somebody goes oh hey there's a missile launcher on the top floor it's like well i kind of would have liked to have you know let it catch me off guard but now that we're just sauntering on back to diamond city I like to torture my mods? No, I would never. I do need, um, I need to have a, I, so I use this thing called Chatterino. Um, that's the app that I use to read my chat. It's more customizable than just popping out Twitch chat. Although I don't really see uh, badges and there, there's just other information that I would like to see during a stream It's eight Celsius here in Scotland Is that really is that like super cold? Cuz I I measure heat on the Imperial system, you know on that zero to 100 scale 
the far superior temperature measurement system? How many hot units is it today? 100's a lot, zero is not. It's the imperial temperature system. I'd like to take this moment to thank the Academy. We made it in and out of the tower in one life. The other attempts do not count because they weren't official. I was just practicing. Metric system is more commonly used by scientists and has been proven to be more effective. So here's where I disagree with you slightly. Scientists are not normal people. Scientists are incredibly smart. I mean, there's, there's a reason why, as a human society, we have decided that all of the people who go through years and years of study and accreditation and peer-reviewed work and research and all that, there's a reason why we have decided, you know what? You guys answer all the hard problems about why shit happens and why shit exists. Those people are absolutely right. If metric works for them, I agree. Metric is the way to go. You know what? That's how we solve our problems. Hell yeah, all the power to you. You're doing the right thing. But if I'm at a bar and I'm hanging out with friends, you know, we've got a football game on, or if you're in, you know, if you're at the pub in, uh, in Europe and you, you've got the footy game on, you're watching Everton play... Uh, I'm not too familiar with any of the teams, but you know, you're having a casual conversation about the heat. Man, it's been hot out this week, hasn't it? Yeah, gosh, it was nice. 95 degrees the other day. And that's like 95% of hot. And then I, I can understand that very well. <laughs> I can understand that very well. <laughs> now for the sciencey stuff and being more accurate, totally. But casually, colloquially and culturally because I was raised with it and the numbers are ingrained in my head I am going to roller coaster logic my way to an explanation that kind of makes sense <laughs> as much as there are people right now who use Celsius going this fucking idiot these 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 people are idiots <laughs> or like people are like this guy sounds like a moron that's okay. Anyway, we made it back to town. The main quest continues. Uh, so what do we have to do next? Like, am I getting reasonably close to blowing up the Pridwin? So you're saying everyone that uses Imperial is dumb as a brick? No, I'm just saying that Imperial is dumber. Therefore, it works better in a casual conversation if you're just talking about how hot it is. Like, man, it was really hot out this weekend. It was 32. 30. 32 doesn't sound hot. Have a nice day. Ooh, I'm starving. I have some food to cook. Anyway, dumb, stupid conversation that I think we've had on this stream like five times now. Thank you, kind sir. Hey, Ju. Hope you're having a great day. I'm excited to watch this on YouTube when I'm not busy for once. I'm excited for you to have that opportunity. And thank you. Every now and then there's like a, there's a little text-to-speech message where I'm like, oh, that was so sweet. Whenever they start off with, hey, Juve, they always kind of warm my heart. Uh, JD Bean, thank you for two months. Hope you're doing well. Kelvin is where it's at. <laughs> okay. The, that's how the con the conversation always ends up taking that route. It always leads into some guy who thinks Kelvin is cool. Can we all just agree? Kelvin sucks. I think we should all, I think Fahrenheit and Celsius should gang up against Kelvin. Because that's just like the, um, actually, in the conversation, I think we should just both look at him. Shoo. 
Shoo. Now, the name Kelvin, there's nothing wrong with it. But we're... <laughs> the adults are talking, Kelvin. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a confirmed Kelvin hater. You know what? Fuck Kelvin. Yeah, I said it. I got suspended from high school for taking a hard, radical stance against Kelvin. Courser chip analysis. Is that good, neighbor? I'm allowed to go there. My firstborn will be named Kelvin. That's between that and Ethan. Need a place to stay? Try Hotel Rex. I need food more than anything. I'm out here dying. You sticking around? You'll need to join a crew. I hear Bobby No Can't believe it. You look just like Sammy too. Sure as hell didn't act like him. Institute thinks they can replace people with synths in this town? They got another thing coming. <sighs> what am I gonna tell his mother? Hey, just your friendly neighborhood watch. Shooting down Institute spies as they crop up. Glad you took care of him. Thanks. <laughs> At least synth doubles die just like the real... <laughs> 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 Never gotten that to work. reason to be bothering me. I just had to shoot up a synth body snatcher over here. You killed him. Just like that? Hey, hey. I don't like what you're implying there, smooth skin. If he was just a synth, there'd be no problem. But he killed Sammy, replaced him. But we know our own better than any institute. The dead body's still in the clip. So we did what we had to do. Now get out of my face. The institute and their synths. Not so scary now, huh? Oh, you can't throw them nearly as far as you can in space game. What is his voice? Are you talking about Nate or Dr. Jacques? You're back. The glowing sea. Virgil. What happened? Oh, you don't even want to know. No, it's actually, it was miserable. I found Virgil. He has a way inside the Institute. But I need a code from a Corsair chip. A Corsair chip. chip? You fought a Corsair? Oh my god. Unfortunately, I can't help you. I've worked on a lot of synths, but never a Corsair. I don't know what that chip does. You know, I gotta say, it is kind of fun. But there are uh, hold on, I'll let her finish. I work with a group that, well, uh -huh. they're called... Uh, what's kind of fun about doing a challenge run like this is that that fight with the Corsair was genuinely like balls to the walls. I am pumping myself with so many drugs. I have so many negative effects. I'm running out of ammo. I came down to, I maybe could have taken two shots and I would have died. <clears throat> so when another character in game is like, oh my gosh, you fought a courser? You're, you're crazy for that. It kind of makes me go, yeah, you know, that was an intense ass fight. And I came out the victor. I am kind of badass. Whereas, like, if you're playing the game on vanilla, or God forbid, on very easy difficulty, you're going to walk in there with one shotgun blast, send the courser flying with no limbs and an exploded head against the wall, and then you'll be done. So that when she goes up to you and she says, you killed a courser? Whoa. It doesn't really land. It makes It kind of makes no sense. Were you going to say something? Thanks, Doc. How do I find them? I can't contact them directly. They usually come to me when they have a synth that's escaped the Institute and wants new memories. But I do have a code phrase. Some kind of clue if I ever... All right. Are Good you... luck. I'm sorry what... The memory den's not accepting new clients right now, sweetheart. Super cool thing that only happened to a few players. I bet it was pretty cool for people that accidentally stumbled into the railroad without even doing the quest. They just ended up in their basement. Got a problem? Why are you threatening me? Looks like we got another freak just won't fit anywhere else. Damn, we need to figure out food. Don't be shy now. Chances are we have whatever you're looking for. I'll take a look, sure. Cash or trade, let's get started. 
289. I actually looted a lot of ammo. We did pretty well. Take the 10 mil. And then I'm going to go from here back to Red Rocket. Because I need to do some home maintenance, figure out my food situation, maybe stock up a little bit, do a little bit of grinding. Not a ton, but just some. Like this. A warm spot with a cold beer would be heaven. Not now, Piper. We got to get back to work. Piper. Heading my way? Sure, let's go. Will do. Okay, I'm gonna run to the bathroom, grab another water. You think I cheated? Is Good Neighbor a settlement? You can fast travel from there. Uh, we're counting, yeah, we'll count Good Neighbor, Diamond City. We'll count those. I, I figure if we if we count Diamond City, I'm just going to count Good Neighbor. I want to get this, you know, moving a little bit. But that's why also, because we can fast travel, I'm more willing to take on dungeons like the one that we just took on with, you know, kind of low ammo and kind of shitty. I'm going to run. Real quick to the bathroom, I'll be back. You guys can hang out with our usual friend, Chair. I wanna make sure you get a good jam though. Yeah, this is a pretty good one. Come on, chat. Sorry about that. Be another minute.
Okay, uh, okay, uh, chat, I've never done this before. Um, but, uh, I'm gonna... Uh, mods, uh, uh, mods, put out a gamble on how long it takes me to come back. Over, under, uh, six and a half minutes. Nature is, nature, you know, nature is calling. Also, I'll try to give you a bit longer of a song. That might have been the same song again.
Damn. Damn. I gotta be honest. I need I need a second. I need a sec. I need a sec. You know the you know the ones. You know the ones. When nature kind of uh catches you off guard. Whew. What caused this monster? I have no clue. But I do need to go for one more second. I did. Wa I washed my hands. Of course I washed my hands. Didn't finish with a wet wipe? I did. I am a wet wipe truther. I don't know why I was hearing the chugging and slurping. But alright, we're back. Yeah, no, I don't know why someone wouldn't use wipes honestly like the only reason i could see somebody not using butt wipes is because if they're like a really insecure dude who thinks like butt wipes are gay or something like i could see i could totally see somebody being like why would i use butt wipes my my ass smells like shit but you're like what Okay. It's a poor man's. It's a poor man's. Well, so here's the thing. They made dude wipes. Right? Like, they made dude wipes to, I guess, make dudes feel okay about getting wipes. You could just get baby wipes. They're the same thing. And yes, they are bad for septic tanks. Don't, don't flush them. Yeah, real men. <laughs> real men wear their skid marks. All right. I'm not wiping my butt. Yeah, the, the thing with dude wipes is they give you like 20 of them. So they give you a really second. small amount of them. Dude wipes meant chiller king. They're, they're good, but it's branding. And then they sell you less wipes and... What are you doing on these roads? I I cleared out Concord. If you aren't brotherhood, you're nothing. Back off, civilian. <laughs> I don't have time for you right now. <laughs> okay. Fuck you. All of you. Oh, I'm going to hold my I'm going to hold my tongue and my trigger finger. But they they deserved it. They deserved it. Yeah, BLS more like PLS. Am I right? Dude wipes. <laughs> That's a now who's this? 
You here to trade? Boy? That's that that's a real that's a real thing though. Hundred percent for sure. There are definitely dudes who think that like if they got caught using wipes, like using butt wipes, that it would like emasculate them or something. Be like butt wipes, more like gay wipes, dude. I don't wipe my butt. Why would I do that? Like, <laughs> clean your ass, man. They're like, wait, same like with a bidet. I've never used one. Never really been in in like, like in a position to use a bidet, but I definitely want to try one. Can confirm started having sex with dudes after butt wipes. <laughs> I know some some people would. Uh, can somebody explain a bidet? Is a bidet like a device that you add to your toilet? Because I honestly have not looked into it all that much. They save you a fortune. You can stall in a regular toilet. I got one for forty dollars. Oh, I'm getting one. Okay, I'm gonna hold on. I'm gonna get a bidet. I'm gonna order one right now. I'm gonna keep the speed run timer going. Uh, obviously I can't show you my screen if I'm looking through Amazon Bidet. Home install. Ooh, I should get one for my dad too. Cause I bet my dad, while he's, while well, my dad's in recovery right now, I bet he's got a stinky ass. Bidet, toilet, seat attachment. So it's like, it's just a little attachment, and then you got like, what, like a hose thing? DIY install in eight minutes or less. I'd somehow turn it into a half hour ordeal. Oh, and it's, it's got like a, <laughs> it's kind of funny. Never seen one. Yeah, right. Dad, I got us matching bidets. I'll get one later. We'll worry about that another time. Stream the install. I can't let you guys see my bathroom. Also, I have no clue who this is. Who are you? What are you doing out here? Name's Dreth. That's all you need to know. Now, you're here for business? I ain't got all night. That sounds like a Morrowind reference, right? Doesn't that sound like a Dunmer last name? Dreth? You a traitor? Sure. Let me see what you've got. All right, let him through. Let me through to, to where? Where am I going through to? If you wanted to make me a second printing press while you're at it. What's the origin of the name Juve? I should probably have a command in chat that just explains it. Should just be like exclamation point lore. Um, I was in a garage band my senior year of high school. It wasn't really even a band. It was more so just a couple knuckleheads who would get together and try to cover, you know, what at the time were some popular alternative rock tunes. Um, a lot of Cage the Elephant because they were very easy songs, especially for me to play. Um, we had this little garage band. And we would meet up on Sundays and we would just kind of jam and try some stuff out. We just had fun. It was good, wholesome fun. And our lead singer, he came up with the name Juvenalia. J-U-V-E-N-A-I-L-I-A. I think that's how it was originally spelled. And then when I first started doing social media, I was out uh, out on the interweb with the name Juvenalia Gaming, spelled wrong because I did not include the first I before L-I-A. So mine was actually spelled like Juvenalia. Spelled it wrong. I always just thought the name was kind of cool. I don't know why. 
But then it was a mouthful, and nobody could really pronounce it correctly all the time. Like, very rarely somebody would pronounce it correctly the first try. And then on a few of my earlier streams... Sorry, I'm a little distracted. On a few of my earlier streams, there were people who started referring to me as Juve, J-U-V, to shorten it. And then one day, a few people started goofing around spelling it J-O-O-V. And I was like, wait a minute. I love it. It's one syllable, four letters, nice and easy. Juve. And so I went with it. I don't really know what the actual original name, what it meant. No clue. Other alternative options, uh, shitty pizza. I remember that was, that was a name that was thrown out there that we laughed about. There's a story here, we'll find it. Thank you, kind sir. Rouge, hey, appreciate it. Thank you for the prime. And, uh, Courier Owns, thank you for the 200 bits earlier. Oh my god. Oh my god. Just need to collect some food. found a new frontier of foul. I need to check myself. Am I cheating at all? No. I did. Oh, I should have scrapped. Thank you, kind sir. Kevo A. Thank you for the prime. Or no, that uh, that was a prime. Okay, yeah, thank you for two months. Been a while since you caught me. Gambino Craft, good to see you again. How are you? Uh, the next little bit of this adventure is probably going to be pretty slow. Because I want to take things relatively safe, gear up again. I don't want to take too many risks. If we spin the wheel and we lose our weapons, it's going to be a huge setback. I got to get back to some junk collection. Some at-home stuff. I don't want to get too involved with the settlement stuff. Because I am really enjoying just going point to point and trying to complete the story quest with a little limited loadout. 20 day vacation started today. 20 day vacation? Babe Crusade. Love that name. Congratulations. You here visiting Covenant, pal? If not, move along. You know, I'm people loyal. I don't really want to mess with Covenant. Covenant kind of sucks. Where's uh, Tappington Boathouse? Is close by, isn't it? Is it on the other side of the lake? No. We're not alone here. I'm well aware. There's a second one. I really just hit Piper. Sorry, Pipe. I smoked her with my bayonet twice. Follow road southeast. Yeah, I think it might be this little square thing here. Ah, I found. I, I see it. Yeah, we followed this road. It wraps around. I think clearing out Tappington Boathouse, getting that somewhat set up as a settlement, and having an extra fast travel point. That's going to be really nice.
should be a fairly low risk venture. Other than the hospital right around the corner. There's a lot of a, there's a lot of content right around this corner. That is kick ass. Super tough if we're not equipped properly. Inside the house! No, 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 no. I might actually die here. My health is going down. Looks like it stabilized, though. That was close. Shout out to Piper for saving my life. Let's see if Piper will take care of it on her own. Hey. Where to? Head over there. Of course. I can't get there. Piper, would you please just go upstairs? Go. Get up. Up, up the stairs. You first. You before me. Except after we. There you go. Fight away, Piper. Hey. Shoot. Get him. That thing is really tanky. Stay right there, Mr. Bloodbug. Please don't move. All right, music. Chill. Chill out, radio. I've been here for too long. I'm going to have to just talk over the radio the whole time. I got nothing. Thank you. Good work, Piper. Worry, worry, worry. I'm a fool about love. La, 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 la. I'm so happy in blood. Yes. Some ammo. Oh, wait, we unlocked that. So we can take it. Uh, time out, time out, time out, time out, time out, time out. No on the grenades, no on the landmine. Because those I would have to use. Save our game. I know the radio is really nice. I like it a lot. I, I like when you find radios in like a house or something versus uh, just like on the Pip-Boy constantly the whole time. Mom, Russell has been gone over a day now and I'm getting worried. We were going to wait to tell you, but we found an old holotape from before the war in the boat shed. It sounded like someone had stashed some chems in the drainage at the end of the canal. Russell thought we might be able to sell them to one of the traders. Maybe use the caps to buy another Brahmin. I'm sorry we didn't tell you. We just wanted to, to be a surprise. But that's the second one of those bugs we've seen today, and I think something went wrong. So I'm going to have a look for him. Don't worry. I'm just going to take a quick peek, and I'll be back soon. I don't know why I turned into Wes Johnson's Imperial Guard by the end of that. Don't move. You know, he does a great impression of the Imperial Guards and Wes Johnson's Oblivion performance is Emmett Lefebvre. He does a really great, uh, when, when it was announced that the Rick and Marty voice actors were going to change, he posted a video that was just like, hi, I'm auditioning for the roles of Rick and Marty. And he just did all of their lines in the Oblivion Guard voice. 
It was very funny. You just had to be there. Traps in here. 99% sure. But I don't think I'm too, too worried about that right now. Let's use this safe point. Back to Red Rocket. No. I guess you've got your reason. But that doesn't look like junk to me. What do you mean I have my impression you've been living amongst all the workbenches that I have to use the whole time? So we can scrap this one. This one. Uh, we can do a powerful receiver. Another huge buff to the deliverer. Extended barrel. I'll definitely take more range. This helicopter's getting way too close to our base. What the hell's going on out there? Who are they fighting? Oh, I don't have the ammo for this. Preston, can you take care of them, please? And there's a deer here. What is going on? Okay, I need to hurry up and make ammo. I can't make any. Why did I come back here? All right, I wasn't expecting to ever have zero ammo. Tired again. I'll sleep off the invasion. You always nail all the priests slaughtered. The whole chapel desecrated. That one's not very good. Or maybe that one time it wasn't that great. I look, I hate this. They might as well get on the speaker above me. Have no fear. Stay indoors. We are not here to pillage your town. Wink. Thomas, that part wasn't part of the script. What are you doing? You're not supposed to say, wink. Fine. I'll go hunt in the old-fashioned way. <gasps> food. Finally, some food. What level do I have to be for Gun Nut 3? Gun Nut Rank 3, 25? We only have to level up six more times, but those six levels are going to take a while. I can make harpoons. Oh, this is just ammo. Wait, I can break down ammo? Since when could I break down ammo? Oh, this is incredible. I love this. I love this so much. This almost feels like cheating. But honestly, I don't know if I care. Oh, we are set. I can stay stocked up on 10 millimeter rounds. I'm hitting for 60 with this little thing. I would like to make another gun just for the variety of it all. I don't really know what we would make though. Sweet. Now I, I actually do feel pretty good about just taking on the next quest. 
molecular level find the railroad have the courser chipped analyzed okay so finding the railroad should be pretty easy we just have to do it through diamond city a sniper 50 cal pipe pistol um i'll probably pass on that but it's not a terrible idea actually no it is a terrible idea that idea stinks I won't do that. I hate all of your suggest. No, I'm just playing. Uh, I, I want to. I kind of want to make a plasma pistol. I don't know why. I just feel like I never use plasma pistols. Well, I already know where the church is. Of course, it's at night. It's never in daytime. It's probably closer to Good Neighbor. I should have traveled there. It's not Trinity Plaza. Ooh, maybe I don't remember exactly where it is. I think it's north of Swan. You tried zooming in on the map? What, on your end, you tried to mouse roll or mouse scroll? This has been such a sick playthrough. Has it really? That's kind of surprising, to be honest. Uh, mainly just because I've enjoyed it. You know, but sometimes with like a challenge run, sometimes People are mixed on like the rules or maybe it just doesn't show very compelling until maybe it's edited in post. Oh, we're getting a lot of food. This is awesome. Not hitting too many dangers either. I guess what I really like about this run is it we are finally for like the first time ever engaging in Fallout 4's main story. Because I'm getting all the Steam achievements, and I've never gotten them. Got mods on this bitch or what? Uh, not too many. Only the the main one that we're using is one where we can craft ammo, weapons, and armor. That's a ton of raiders. Why are there so many of them? Whatever is making that smell needs to seek medical attention immediately. Thought you could hide? Blue or not? Hey, they're here. Oh, this is so OP. <laughs> oh, yikes. Oh, what? That's trash. How the hell? <gasps> you cheater. They might say that I'm cheating at times throughout this challenge, but that was real cheating. Worth every septum. We have fun when you have fun. Also, when are you doing Sol's time too? I'm a photo say appreciate it. Uh, Solstheim 2, I have it on my list. It's probably like three or four projects down the line, I think. I'll have to double check because I'm constantly like, I'll have a whole list of things that I want to do. And then I'll think of something and be like, oh, wait, that actually sounds really fun. And that'll kind of get thrown up the list. Don't have any water.
first one is the uh, first Souls time is your favorite. I loved it. I had so much fun with it. But man, it, it really did stink blowing it at the end. I mean, we were right there. The only thing we have to do, and I'm going to have to go back and rewatch that entire video as like a guide for myself. But the only thing that we need to ensure time out. Oh, fun. Okay, the fact I'm putting down a Yao Guai in three shots is ridiculous. I feel like I'm leveling up significantly faster on this playthrough. We could do Lead Belly 2. I don't think we need it. Strong Back 3? No, no, no. No. The last three ranks of strong back kind of stink. I'm gonna take life giver. What do you think that was? I'm not really even following the freedom trail. I'm just wandering. Habits house. Oh, was that the aliens? We need to see if anyone was hurt, right? Chat, I'm going to be completely honest with you. That's got to be the church. It looks like a church on the map. But yeah, if I'm being honest, I got kind of lost there. I don't remember where the church is. No, I want to... Oh, the boxing gym! We can get a ton of lead in here. There's a location right by here I really want to discover, and it's bothering me that I can't scratch that itch. Just got to get it off the map. Come on. Oh, it won't go. I just want it to trigger. down here so quickly piper you're starting to get really good at this also yeah i am uh, i'm oh, oh oh i'm broken i i think i have hit the point where i'm really 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 overpowered but i guess i'm gonna have to be what the fuck was that i'll be i'll be so squishy that the brotherhood of steel are gonna be tough I'll have to be fast. Fusion cores. I think I'm carrying five fusion cores right now. Next time I find a traitor, I can't forget. Get in through the front. Let's try the back. Or maybe this is the front. Um. Piper, I think something's wrong. Here, Piper, you, right. you chat test this out. Go there. Yeah, walk into the void. I don't want to. 
Okay, looks safe. It is safe. I wonder if this has to do with my install of Frost. Maybe Frost didn't completely uninstall all the way. in the basement what is going on hopefully the entrance to the basement isn't missing or something we got invisible stairs a ghoul who I can hear but I can't see All right, Vans. Oh, crap, that's right. Vans won't be able to track this one. What am I missing here? Found it. Yeah, that was anticlimactic. I'm just an idiot. Wh I I I I don't I don't. <laughs> Todd. Todd, help! Your underground is scaring me. Ah, oh, sweet, sweet. I was gonna say cool. Then I was gonna say sweet. Then I combined them into a word that doesn't exist. I was gonna say oh sweet wall hacks. I can see one of them. Oh, come on, come on. This doesn't count. This is not a normal way to play the game. <laughs> can I shoot him? No, there's a wall there. What wall is it? I don't know where the wall ends and where the wall begins. Oh, wait, this is the password. Okay, okay, my game is definitely gonna crash. So. Oh no, oh god, my broken arm is gonna make me hit the wrong buttons. So, that's not right. Mm -hmm. That was incorrect. Okay, this is easy. R. A. Uh, so let's start with R. This is like the faction equivalent of making your password password. R. O. A. I went the wrong way. D. Maybe the f maybe the railroad has just gotten really good at security. I can see them. Stop right there. Oh yeah, this is not I don't think this is as intended. But before we go any further, answer my questions. Who the hell? Time out. Are you? Why is he silver? 
He looks like uh, he looks like the Silver Surfer. Is that, that's not Deacon. His clothes are. Why does everyone in here look like they're going to a goth concert? He's dressed for the rave. He kind of looks like an old school burglar. I don't know what the hell's going on here. And she's completely normal. I followed the freedom trail looking for the railroad. I'm not your if enemy. If that's true, you have nothing to fear. Who told you how to contact us? Dr. Omari told me how to find you. Very interesting. Last question. Why are you here? I tracked down and killed a courser at Green Tech Genetics. Now I need help breaking the code on his courser chip. You have chip. what? This is not a joking matter. I didn't know we were having a party. Oh, okay. Well, All right, Deacon, mind. Deacon, uh, oh, no. Hey, hey, Deacon, in the, in the year nice. 2023, Deacon. I don't You're know right. if that I'm comfortable having that. <laughs> uh, Deacon, that that went out of style a few decades ago. That is give even Gloria run for her. News flash, boss. This guy is kind of a big deal. If you're done interrogating him, you might want to show this coarser murdering machine a little courtesy. Hmm? Just a thought. I owe you an apology. Anyone who Deacon owes all of us an apology for being honest here, Desi. And I'm the leader of the railroad. Hopefully we can work something out. What you're asking for puts us in a tricky position. Des, we need to let him in. He's got an intact courser chip for God's sake. That violates our security protocols. To hell with that. This violates my ethics right protocols. No <laughs> Fix it, Deacon. Fix We're it. Letting you into our head. Us, oh, hard to watch. The first outsider ever to be given this privilege. We'll discuss the details about your chip inside. Okay, hopefully, hopefully everything fixes when we go in there. I'm assuming. Piper, no, not you! No, no, not you too, Piper! Wait, is it happening to me? Oh. Okay, all right. I still look incredibly hot and cool. This is a nightmare. How? It's gotten worse. The least of which is losing the data. It's worse. It's it, it, is this exploding? Okay, yeah, it is exploding on your end too. I think I took too many drugs to kill that courser. What? What? I. Hey, dude. Hey, don't Did try anything, come? stranger. Our here has a Whoa! For real? Oh, man, it's been ages! Right. Some ground rules. Tom can get you the code, but once he's done. Okay. All right, all right. We're gonna. I'm gonna quick save here. Let's, let's see if just loading our save fixes it. And it crashed. I had a feeling it that was on the way. Usually when the game starts losing its mind like that, it's about to crash. Yeah, we're canceling everybody in the railroad. All right. The railroad, we, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta fix that. Yeah, right. I like I, I stepped on a used jet uh, or I stepped on a used psycho needle outside. It's a mod conflict or a dirty edit. X edit could tell you. Yeah, my thought is. I have a feeling this isn't going to work. <gasps> oh, it worked. Whew. It worked. It worked. I'm, I'm, I'm glad it worked because. Honestly, 
Honestly, straight up, I wasn't about to have, you know, a significant portion of my video be filled with blackface. I mean, we can make fun of like how ridiculous it looks and everything like that, but too much of it, like, nah, <laughs> nah, I'm good. I have never seen that before. He's been borrowed. Right, some ground rules. Tom can get you the code, but once he's done, we get the torture chain. He's out for good. Yeah. Fine. It's yours. All right. I'm not Tom, make it happen. All right, little corsage. Let's have the circuit analyzer take a crack at you. Weird week of work, huh, Tom? We're in. Chip accessed. Just poke the analog connectors a little. I got my what? eye on you, Desdemona. I won't forget. Don't crash. Hold it together. Memory hiccup. Here it comes. Encryption algorithms. All right. All right, we're still running. Don't try anything, stranger. Oh, man. They've added more decimals to the last cipher. Oh, uh, no. This is gonna be... Come on, baby. Show me that pattern. Where He's going it? with, like, the goat beard. They're using the same logarithmic function as the key generator. Oh, man, we got lucky. I got you, you institute bastard. I got you. All right, software in. Come on. Show me that sweet bass number. Come on, baby. All right, move on, move on, move on. We're on to, we're on to bigger and better things. <laughs> Let me load that onto the hollow tape. Well, yeah. Good work, Tom. Yeah, but I'm not sure our luck will hold up next time, Des. Start working on the rest of the chip. And you, I'd love to work with you more. Let me know if you're interested. But to be crystal clear, if you use that data and discover anything involving the Institute, you share it with us first. Otherwise, our relationship will be in jeopardy. Did she make it to the border? Still waiting to hear from Randolph. Oh shit, wait, what's my quest? Oh, we gotta go back to Virgil? Well, the whole safe house I don't have a fast travel point to get to Virgil. What's the closest I can fast travel? Diamond City? Oh god. Do I have to walk through the Ugh. Don't try anything, stranger. Okay, it's it's still it's back. It's not broken. I am not looking forward to going all the way back. Yeah. Diamond City is for sure the closest we have. It's not that long of a run. It's just annoying. And I do have, we have Radex, we have Radaway. So I can definitely get there in just one run across the glowing sea. And I'm an Iron Man. Well, we're going to have to come back. We're going to have to come back to the railroad eventually, right? I can only carry 30 more pounds. We'll get the lead later. We'll worry about it another time. Probably like after this quest. So can I ask anybody in chat, just because I basically haven't stopped thinking about this game since I finished it. Has anybody in chat played Alan Wake? Well, I played the played the second one, the one that just I'm dead. <sighs> Thought I was going to cost myself there. <clears throat> OK, we hit good neighbor. That's bad. That's bad. Uh, I'm taking the checkpoint outside of the church. I'm gonna do a small cheat because I'm not going through all that dialogue again. So I'm especially not typing in the railroad password again.
We'll take it on the chin, whatever it is. Oh my gosh, how many times are we gonna get the double spin? All right, so we gotta take two negatives here. I'm hoping we lose a special point and drop armor. No, we got it. Yes, okay, drop. I'm okay with dropping armor. I'm more than all right with that. We can make more armor. We don't have a ton of armor. That's kind of a tough one. Okay, so we're gonna lose our armor and our clothes. And if Piper goes down again, she's out. Oh, but uh, I, I was gonna say, if anybody's played Alan Wake 2, um, I have that one, I have that one song. If you've played the game, you know the song. But I have had it stuck in my head. A non, like, I cannot get this song out of my head. All the time. Th right, throughout this entire stream, the song has been in my head. Oh, that really sucks. I mean, I get to show off my rockin' bod, but that really stinks. That was about 25 pounds. So I am, I'm gonna grab the lead weights. Oh, I can barely, you can't carry anything. Five lead. Nine lead for 40 pounds. That's all I can really carry. There's a five pound weight I can take. Ten pounds is too much. I am going to try and go through the glowing sea completely naked, though. I'm going through naked. I'm probably just going to do in the final video, do a hard cut from having to drop all my armor to just running across the glowing sea naked. Nice little find. Jabbo, good to see you again. It's always comforting seeing his face downtown while out on my adventure. It's like he's rooting for me, you know? He's up there saying, go, come on. You can finish out this challenge. Woo, run, Piper, go. Go, 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 go. You've got to be kidding me. She got herself killed that quickly. Well, there goes Piper. Piper is off the board. We can no longer use her as a follower. What the hell, Pipes? We were honestly, we had a great thing going. We had an awesome working relationship. Piper, I hardly know her. Do do. Thank you. Thank you, everybody, out on the internet, out in Twitch chat, on the VOD channel. Anybody watching on Diet Juve, thank you for coming out tonight. I'll be here all night telling zany and hilarious one-liners just like that. Subscribe for more. I hope you're buying. Even a girl with an arsenal full of weapons needs to make a living after all. Let's see what you've got. Let's get you outfitted, killer. I kind of see the appeal. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not saying 
I agree. I'm not saying I agree. I'm simply saying I understand. <gasps> Fusion cores. Who needs ammo? We can make our own. Or who needs to make our own ammo? We can buy it. Same thing. Diamond City. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We want to go. We're going to go Diamond City. We're going to sleep there, figure out food and water while we're in town. And then we are going to go whoop, straight through the glowing seat of Virgil's place, all on foot, all naked, all ripped. Wait a minute, no, it's midday. Do I really want to sleep? Oh, it's 10 a.m. It's the perfect time. I don't want to go at night. I'm sick of exploring at nighttime. Okay, hydrated. Get our hydration up. Get some food in us. None of it's cooked. Kim is you have by marvelous bone myself. structure. And I stop by the mega surgery sometime. That's the first real accurate compliment I've ever gotten. Get off, more important. This is my game, not yours. Don't know you, Scabba. Radiation poisoning is a common ailment, but we can cure just... Patch me up, Doc. What's feeling off? I'm pretty beat up. Scrapes and... Now that we've got all the dumb, grindy bullshit out of the way... Done. Now, was there anything else bothering you? That was it. Off you go, then. One man journeys back to the glowing sea. No radiation suit, no armor, only his abs and a steel will, iron will, to complete his objective. Why am I naked again? I spun the wheel and I had to drop all of my armor. <clears throat> Which, because clothing in this game typically offers a buff, I think that should be included. The great search for pants is on. I will find myself a pair of trousers in Virgil's cave. Oh, my dude, Verge! I can't wait to go see him. He's on the verge of having sex for the first time, but he's not quite there yet. Can I just have a peaceful journey? You know, can we not make it problematic on my way down there? I'm gonna let them... No, Deathclaw's gotta die. God, I'm so good. I'm so fucking good. That was pretty good. This gun is really, like, I mean, it's stupid overpowered. Can your character craft a bidet? No, but they should put bidets in Fallout. It's high time we've added bidets to this game. <laughs> Todd Howard gets on stage for Fallout 5. We've added the fan, the much requested fan favorite feature. Finally, at your settlements, you can craft a bidet so that you and each and every one of your settlers can blast their ass with cold or hot water. And no, <laughs> this would be the most Todd Howard way to announce it too. He'd be on stage. And yes, 
it also comes with a real life bidet that you can sync up with your in-game character now you can take a shit alongside your settlers in fallout <laughs> in fallout 5 as long as, as, long as, as, long as i can dramatic and yes it is heated <laughs> Oh, uh, God, I want a new Fallout game. I'm really excited for Fallout London. It's a pretty, it's a cool project. I think it's got a lot of potential. I'm always a bit wary about, uh, hold on. One sec, I got an old yeller my way across this bridge and then we can continue chatting. Um, I, I'm always a little, just a little bit wary of like fan projects and stuff like that. Uh, just cause, A, I think it's unfair to put like a ton of pressure on, you know, basically a volunteer project, um, but I'll always support it and root for them to be really, really good. Cause as we've seen over the last few years, modding really does, <laughs> you, you wanna, if you wanna work on these games, pretty good way to beef up your resume is by building experiences you know, within Creation Engine. So I'll always root for people that are putting together something, you know, ambitious like that with a small team. I think it's badass. But also it's important to, you know, for something like that, a project like that, to just keep your expectations in check. I hear a dog. No, I don't hear a dog. I hear another stupid helicopter. You know what? I just saved my game. I just got to Ooh, it's not worth risking the roll. Is it worth risking a roll? Do I spin the wheel? Do I finally take on the Brotherhood in armed combat? Die, Brotherhood scum. It's going down. It's going down. No, he's got a shot. He's got shots on me. No, no, you bastard. I had him. He had no health. He was dead. He kind, was sir. dead. No. Oh, I'm going to lose my gun. I know it. I know it. I know it. This this is the spin where I finally lose my gun. This is it. It's finally happening. Oh, don't. I don't want to look. No, don't! No, 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 no. That's even worse. That's even worse. That's even worse. It's actually, that is comical how fucking bad that is. That could not be. <laughs> no, no, why? Why? Todd, is this because I made fun of how you, like, deliver speeches? I, you're a great orator. You didn't have to. Is this because, is this because of the, the thing earlier with the glitched textures? I... Whew, okay, yeah, this is not this is not good. This is bad. This is in fact really bad. We're 13 and a half hours in. I knew it. Oh my gosh. And we had just upgraded it. It was overpowered 71. We're dealing 71 damage with this bad boy. No apparel, no weapons. I have some drugs. I have Radix, I have Radaway, I have Stimpax. I can get to Virgil. I don't need to defend myself. The goal is to blow up the Pridwin, okay? Not shoot them all with a pistol. The goal is to blow up their home base. I can do that. I don't need guns right now. I don't need clothes right now. All I need is determination. Oh. Shit. My bad, my bad, my bad. I forgot that it was drop everything. Yeah, uh, okay, okay, maybe I need a little bit more than determination. 
Yeah, no, no. After, after further review, I need just a little bit more. Oh, no, this is ammo. Oh, God, this might be the hardest part of it all. It just, it, it genuinely is painful watching it go. Oh, fuck. I'm gonna need to save here. <laughs> I gotta save here because this is a great shot. Well, I mean, now I have to just rethink everything. How many in-game uh, in days has it been? Since we were in the glowing sea. I can do it. I can do it. When's my, do I have a perk? I don't have any perks. I also don't have any points into rad resistance. That's bad. Uh, but the good news is, when we get into the glowing sea, that first bunker that we ran to, right here, Capsized Factory. Capsized Factory is a place that refreshes, both with enemies and with loot, down in the basement. The Radaway respawns on that shelf. So it's possible that we get to the edge of the glowing sea, where we do get a quick save, we get a quick save at the edge of the glowing sea, so we can try this a couple of times. Spins right now mean nothing. I'm playing with house money. There is zero risk to trying to go through and get Virgil this way. What, what on the board? What, am I gonna drop my bobby pins? Okay. I've already dropped everything. The only spin that I want to avoid is losing special. If I start really stacking up special point losses, then we start to run into more issues. I'm gonna allow myself to lose two special points in an effort to get to Virgil naked. Cause I'm gonna beat this damn challenge in a reasonable amount of time and the best way to do that is to take advantage right now. Can I get a ride? Hey, you guys have taxi services like Brotherhood of Steel Uber? Uberhood of steel. Gonna have to watch out for uh, red scorpions as well. I need to make sure that my angle is proper. Yeah, I mean, we're going directly to Capsized Factory. We just have to hope. I gotta think about it for a second. Will I be able to get all the way to the rocky cave? I forgot to remove my caps. We need to think about this for a second. Is it... I guess Capsize Factory is on the way there. But is it even smart to distract myself with going there? Sentinel site's going to be useless. I was able to get to the Sentinel site. I think I am going to have to hit Capsize Factory. I'm giving Anakin Skywalker right now in real life or in game? about to kick in seems like there's a delay when you're first going into the glowing sea still no reds keep this going let me get let me get an extra 40 feet
how is it not going right now? Are we just, did we just luck out? Capsize factory is close, but if we don't, there we go. All right, rads are on. Three per second, that means we have two and a half minutes, three minutes. Just gotta get to Virgil's cave. How the hell am I gonna get back out of the glowing sea though? I have to check capsize factory. Okay, Deathclaw didn't see us, that's good. What's 1,000 divided by three? That's how many seconds we have. Well, minus 150. Went the wrong way. Shit. I'm south of it. Uh, and I just took a big hit. Although the bad news is, if this place respawned, it will be full of feral ghouls. Empty. Damn, Don't it's empty. Bobby pins. Didn't respawn yet. And I'm going the wrong way. Just brain fungus or glowing fungus? Does it give any resistance? Nah, no, just health. Nothing. Nothing. Damn, we struck out. And there's a red scorpion right there, ready to greet us. Oh yeah, just, oh, just punch me right in the face with reds. I'm going to the children of Adam. Wait, that's not the children of Adam. Oh, ooh, okay, I can get through this. This is okay. This is, guys, this is fine. This is, you guys underestimate me. Look, that easy. Now they're gone. Where, where are they? Where are they? They may as well have just disappeared. Okay, but really, how am I not able to find the children of Adam right now? They're not through here. Are they? Okay, they are. I swear, I could have just heard a, uh, a red scorpion. Stop right there, stranger. All those you seeking Adam's blood. holy ground. Or is it something more tangible? Your purpose or be it feels so weird being here. Let's see what you have. Very well. All right, you have... You have right away. 268 caps, no problem, my friend. I will trade you a Massachusetts Surgical Journal, Glowing Fungus, and Brain Fungus. Can I go into debt? I'd really just rather take on debt with you. Do you have a moment? What do you need of me, child? There wouldn't be a place I could resupply around here, would there? Seek Brother Ogden. Tell me more about Adam, if you would. Adam gave birth to this world. I know there's a small thing here and within this world, where if you're in conversation with Isolde, infinite rebirth. you we regain health very slowly, but I don't know about radiation. Waiting for the division to bring them all into being. We spread Adam's word and his gifts to those through... All right. As we pass on, 
I say we all come together and pray that we don't lose a special point because of this death. <laughs> the only thing right now that would make me say I'm not going to try and run through the glowing sea naked is if on our first spin, we lose a special point. <clears throat> I start stacking up special point losses and I'm toast. Everything else on the board, though, completely fine. I mean, I'd prefer not to. All right, drop food. We're good. We're safe. Drop food. I don't even have any. There's gunners on top of this bridge. I wonder if the gunners have any supplies. I'm speaking like a main character's monologue in game in their head, you know, in like a in like a, a third person action game where the main character starts giving you tips. It sounds like there's enemies up top. I bet they have useful supplies. Hmm. The bridge is cut. Gonna have to find another way around. I don't really mind that when games do that. <clears throat> I know that's been easy. Uh, I know that's been like a low hanging fruit for people to make fun of. But I don't mind that. So it's a time thing. Because I wasn't getting radiation at this part of the map. It, it doesn't activate until you've been in the glowing sea for a certain period of time, I guess. Am I going to be able to solo like? No. If anything kills me, it's going to be the attack dog. And I'm already moving too slow. Doesn't see me, doesn't see me. Please don't, please. Dude. Dude. <laughs> no, please. I'm frying over here. Why aren't you frying? What kind of radiation do you have? Turn left. Turn left. Turn left. Keep going. Go between the cinder blocks. Holy shit. Okay, we have a chance here. No bobby pins. That dog's awake. No bobby pins. Why? Why must you be locked? I'm taking the dog's bowl. Whew. Look at that timing. <laughs> I'm playing Hitman. These guys are playing Fallout. No way. That's how I get spotted? Are you kidding me? Stupid dog. Fuck was that? <sighs> These guys don't realize what? an entire episode of Three Stooges has been going around nah, their entire base before they can notice. This is all calculated, Chad. I have a... Oh, hey, okay. caked up for a second there as he bounced off the ground. He made sure in death to show you all that he's got a nice ass. He made sure real quick to just be like, boop. Just in case you all missed what I'm working with over here. Again, there's really only one that's a loss for us. Drop food again, drop bobby pins. Doesn't matter, we're safe safe this is all guilt free but new strategy new strategy all right i'm going directly on a line to virgil's place 
because I think that the glowing sea isn't going to start giving you radiation until you've been there for a certain amount of time. First it starts raining, then after the rain, some time will pass and then the radiation hits you. We were able to sneak all the way around on that bridge for a little bit, but we were going at such a slow pace, we saw the rain come in, here comes the rain. After we saw the rain come in, that's when we started to get hit with the radiation. So I didn't sprint last time into the glowing sea. We hit these rocks and we were, we were able to get past those rocks before it started hitting us. <clears throat> it was about here the first time where we got hit with radiation, but now we're well past it without getting any. Hang a Larry at the bridge, take the left side of it. I think there's two uh, death claws over here, so we could be screwed. Now the radiation is active and we're already We're about a third of the way there. So we can close that gap quite a lot before radiation kicks in. Which is good. It's very good. I want to avoid the spicy holes. Can we hit this? You're goddamn right we can hit it. Dangerous spot right here, Rad Scorpion. Do my best to avoid him, but if I can't, so be it. He saw me. Another small hot spot. Huge hot spot. No? Okay, it's safe. I think we're getting there. Something's behind me. Oh yeah, hey, how you doing? I have no interest in extending my car's warranty. Up through here, I think this is a pretty dangerous path we're taking though. Oh, God damn it. Stop. Now I have to waste time avoiding the red scorpions. Uh-oh, uh-oh. We gotta, we gotta juke them out. Use the rocks, confuse them, get your AP back. Get your AP back. Taking on too many radiations. Too many, too many, too many, I'm going the wrong way. God, I went the wrong way. I somehow bamboozled myself into going the wrong direction. I had to keep myself alive. Say it with me. Virgil will have Radaway. Virgil will have Radex. Virgil loves me. Virgil is not offended by all the virgin Virgil jokes that I've made about him. Virgil is cool. He's nice. This is a really far walk. Like, this is really far. I think it's kind of ridiculous that we gotta walk this far. Okay. Okay! You've gotta be kidding me. No way. Oh, that is so painful. Now I'm just stubborn. Now I, like, I have to do this. I have to do this. I am getting there. I am getting there. But not before we spin. Did I up the counter? Clean, safe again. Let me know if I didn't up the counter. I have to veer left. That's a big problem I have. I have to veer left. And I knew that the sting wings would get me. I had a feeling that the sting wings would be there and they would kill me. Because if you remember, the first time we did the glowing sea, 
we tried to make a last effort dash from the Children of Adam over to Virgil's place, and we got killed by, guess who, a Stingwing right in that same little sector. It's just weird how certain deaths in this game stick with me. I'm less scared of the Deathclaw than I am of Stingwings. Hopefully this isn't a spicy zone. It's probably spicy. Yeah, it's spicy. Not too bad though, it only hit plus five. So slightly different angle than last time. Red scorpion right by me. To my right. So let's Bethesda our way up this rock. What is up with the flashing? Something's going on with my game. I don't know why we're hitting plus eight plus nine. Radiation is not affected by market conditions. I'm not sure why you're bringing inflation into my radiation counter. Same exact tunnel. I'm going the same way. Just gotta keep throwing junk in their way. Logs, rocks, trees, whatever the hell we can find, we gotta throw it in their way. Mountain face. Their pathing gets really awkward anywhere around it. Same wings to my right. Come on, buddy. I can see it. I know the ground is spicy. I know it's a little bit hot. He kind of they kind of sprint in Fallout 4. The main character does. If you don't have a gun out, the sprint animation does look like he's stepping on hot coals. Like, look at his feet. around we still have the death claw to worry about but we're home free there's the death claw uh oh oh i'm out of sprint we made it we're all good I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot, guys. I forgot he has a chemistry table here. You can't make right away? Wasn't sure I'd see you again. You managed to get what you need. Oh, healing. So. <clears throat> we're going to have to redo this again because we're going to die. Radix is Tato flower. We, I, we know we can get glowing fungus. Antiseptic, glowing fungus, plastic, purified water. And I need chemist rank one. Okay. I don't know if we can do that, actually. He's got purified water. Copper, oil. No acid. St 
stealth boy. Protect and serve. If only I didn't steal the rat away from here earlier. I have the code. Suppose I shouldn't be surprised. You did get rid of Kellogg after all. Not too much of a leap to take down a courser. How'd you manage to get it decoded? No life monkey 999. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Can you open the lunchbox and hope you get a rat away? Can I? I should try. I've made some friends in the Commonwealth that are you than me. Face like this, I'm not gonna make too many. Dude, quit being so hard on yourself, you Verge. The only one who's been busy. Come on, big I Verge. <laughs> From memory and things I've overheard. That's my dude. Years. That's big Verge. You guys don't know. You guys have no clue. Easy. These hands are ridiculous. Fine motor skills have gone to shit. Here's the symbol explanation. You need to build a device that will hijack the signal the Institute uses to teleport coursers and send you instead. You know the craziest part of the design? That classical music station. That's the carrier signal for the relay. All the data's on harmonic frequencies. You've been hearing it all along. I want to be clear that this isn't my area of expertise. Can your robot get out I of the frame? The They're ruining it. Not engineering or advanced systems or anything. I do look awesome. This is the most awesome I've ever. Get out of the shot, robot. Your confidence is staggering. I'm just saying, I can't guarantee it'll work. But if you can build this device and make use of that code, you should be able to override the signal from the instant. No life exclamation point rules if you want to get a br I mean, brief idea of what we're doing. You build it. You have people that can help. This is a lot for one person, even you. I got it covered. Good. Yeah, I know how to build shit. If there's one thing I'm good at, it's building stuff and using an overpowered pistol. And don't you forget our agreement. I've helped you as best I can. If you make it in there, you find that serum. It's my only hope for ever being normal. So you find it. Now go on. Take these and get to work. You do whatever it takes. Call on whoever you know to help you. Is the mysterious serum, is that part of uh, Cabot's quest? Is that the same serum? It is? Okay. Oh, he's not carrying right away. I was really just hoping. Don't you have work to be doing? Protect and serve. Sentinel site won't have anything. Thank you, kind sir. Hey, Juve, as regular VOD channel watcher, I just wanted to say your audio balancing is always spot on. Makes it easy to have your vids playing in the background. Really? Thanks for that. I appreciate that. Thank you. I honestly, I worry oftentimes about the audio levels of things and whether or not it works. So that's very reassuring. Thank you. Mentats. Red scorpions that wait acid. But I need the perk. Blowing blood pack. Antiseptic. I need a blood pack. I 
can make my own mysterious serum. That's funny. I can make red X, but I would need a tato flower. Why have I all of a sudden just turned this into, hey, we're region locking ourselves. <laughs> it's just, <laughs> it's just nonsense. We just decided, yeah, let's region lock ourselves into the glowing sea. Why not? Halfway through our adventure, let's just do it. We're back to the glowing sea. Yeah, unfortunately, there's just nothing I can do. My best bet is to leave here and go immediately east and hope that I break the glowing sea before dying, but there's just no shot. I mean, I'm at least going to try. I wasted half my AP going outside. You know what? It was a valiant effort, chat. It was a valiant effort. It, it, it was it was a valiant effort. And and just to buy that one fast travel. Just to buy that one fast travel. I'll give you an extra spin. Oh, fuck off. Fuck off. It's like the one thing that actually punishes me. All right, shout out to the handful of people in chat who have never been subbed before, who will now be subbed for the first time. If you're on the VOD channel, you miss out on this entire aspect of the stream. Just letting you all know, you're missing out. Get over here. Do it. Because I really don't want to ever multi-stream. That just sounds messy and obnoxious. You aren't wearing any pants, right? You know you're not wearing any pants, right? Shut up, Preston. I've been through a lot today. Oh, this conversation is gonna look absolutely ridiculous. Hey there. What do you need, General? Well, I need you to stop farting around on the crafting machine. This is serious, okay? I need a signal interceptor. I have plans here to build a signal interceptor that can get me inside the institute. The institute? Why in the world would you want to mess around with them? Don't you don't worry about the specifics, Preston. Okay, this is important. My God. Oh, there it is. There, I was wondering what took so what damn long. Intoxicating innocence. I'm a god. How can you kill a god? Shame on you, sweet Zarabar. You done? <clears throat> you done with the with the done with the nonsense chat? My wife, can you help? My son, doesn't matter. Can you help me or not? We'll give you whatever help we can. Don't worry about that. Now, assuming you could build this thing, what exactly does it do? It gets me inside the Institute. That's all that matters. Okay, General. If you think it will really work, then you should see if Sturgis can make heads or tails of those plans. We've gotten big enough that we're having trouble communicating with all our settlements. It's a good problem to have, and I have a solution. I think it's time to retake the castle. It used to be the Minutemen Man HQ, way before my time. This has well, nothing to do with my teleporter. And most important, it has a powerful radio Preston, we broke up for a reason. To the whole okay, world. A, because I needed to abide by the rules, but also keep the main quest from breaking, and B, you're just annoying. 
Oh, no, I'm, I'm done with your settlement garbage. Okay, we're not going. No, disagree. I don't see how that helps us. We already have an HQ. It's the radio transmitter that we need. Whether we fully rebuild the castle after retaking it will be up to you. So, should I have an assault force assembled near the castle? Bro, no. No, you, you can't just say, like, I, I am the general. I have disagreed with every proposition so far in this conversation. And he's like, yeah, but, like, there's one really cool thing we need. So, um, we're, we're going to do it, right? Like, give me the go-ahead. We'll assemble a task force out of thin air. Because you've never seen the Minutemen assemble a task force at all throughout this entire <laughs> playthrough. No, we're not ready yet. Your call. Just let me know when you're ready to pull the trigger. I'll let you know if I hear of any settlements that need our help. In the meantime, make sure to offer help to anyone that needs it. That can only help our cause. Now you stop working? Do I have to take the castle? Or do I just continue with the railroad? I need right away. Do I, can I make clothes? I could, we gotta make my vault suit again. I gotta make a gun. This sucks. We, we have to start with the gun first. So if I want to make the deliverer again, adhesive, screw, we'll just tag it all for search. The hell can I go to get some of these? I have no money. I have to talk to Sturgis. I want to get rid of this heartbeat, if anything. But there's no doctors anywhere nearby. I could fast travel all the way to Diamond City. True, that cave underneath. That might have something. Could be some loose nonsense around here. Ooh, dog food. Mmm, yummy. I really scraped this place clean, didn't I? I hate the heartbeat. Cheating. Bobby pins, that's nice. Ah, uh, help. I'm not strong enough to fight red roaches right now. Settlers, arm yourselves. The winged menace is attacking. <laughs> the, the, the winged menace is attacking sanctuary. He said that was some. He said that was some gusto. In all, the inner workings are top notch, and I see you've taken up a new look. I take it the missus approves. Where is the wife, by the way? <laughs> is, is that a unique line he has for if you're naked? I see you've taken up a new look. He kind of does. He does look like he's miserable. Like he's slowly dying. They... They killed her. Heavens, no. Such a 
tragedy. If I could feel, I would be quite distraught over the news. And young Sean, what of your son? I'm looking for him. Someone took him from the vault. But I'm going to find Sir, him. Sir, this news, this terrible news. You must let me assist you in the search for young Sean. I simply cannot remain here knowing the lad is in danger. Yes, of course. Lead the way, sir. Come on, Cosworth. I need a hired gun. Seeing as I don't have a gun right now. Sir, anything good? Cosworth gives out uh, purified water, doesn't he? Oil. Good. We need oil. Right away. Oh, God. Right away would have just been amazing right there. Kickball, we're gonna need rubber. Definitely was worth coming back to Sanctuary. We found a good amount. Cheating. And some glass. I apologize for the heartbeat constantly going off in the background. Is there a vanilla last name for Nate and Nora? I just thought of that. I don't know why. Are there any, like, uh, canon references to the couple that give them a last name? Their last name is Fallout. Nate and Nora Fallout. Flip lighter. I don't think cigars are worth for... useful for anything. Now we're talking. Only thing I gotta find is just get lucky and find some right away. I bet I can make my gun. Let's talk to Sturgis, get that conversation out of the way so we can maybe get the plans to at least build uh, the teleporter. Clearly, those two were busy. One of these houses would be a good place to set up some beds. Don't care. Preston thought you might be able to figure out these plans for sure me. Sure thing. Let's see what you've got. Me struggle read. Preston say you read. Here you go. Wow. He sounds the the it's way when his voice slows down that much. He sounds like a super mutant. Looks like uh, encrypted RF transmissions. Okay, so that gets routed through. What the hell? Teleportation? This is some pretty crazy shit. You sure it's for real? I wouldn't be wasting your time if I didn't think it was real. Okay, okay. Tell him off, Nate. You got it, I mean, Jock. It isn't every day somebody asked me to build him a teleport hijacker. Anyway, the eggheads never think about the nuts and bolts of actually making something work. But, uh, looks like it's all here. Yeah. I'm gonna need some time to study this thing. The handwriting's pretty hard to make out. But, uh, you can get started on what he calls a stabilized reflector platform. Uh, it'll need some pretty high-grade metals, but it's basically not that different than the lining of a jet in. Good work, Sturgis. Well, don't thank me yet. I think I got the gist of it. Here's a list of what you'll need for the first piece. I'm pretty sure we've got all that at Sanctuary, if you want to build it there. While you're working on that, I'll get busy. Right. Keep in mind, mm -hmm. like if you had a spare, <laughs> and it's... Uh -huh. This is gonna be a pain in the ass to build, isn't it? Hey, whoa, 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 what is all this? Mm. 
I gotta stick to my guns. Aluminum, circuitry, steel. That's it. That's actually not that much. I'm gonna move Sturgis to Red Rocket. We're gonna build it at Red Rocket so that we can keep our building materials in line with the challenge. Sanctuary's been compromised. Where is Sturgis? Where did he get off to? Oh, he's probably going to break a quest. Do I look like I want to chit chat? Hope Juve Dad is recovering. He is. He's recovering well. And he. Certainly appreciates. Can I not move him? Oh, he has to be a sanctuary. Let's trade some things. I'm busy. Oh, sweet. We can move him. All right, get over to Red Rocket. Then we can continue the quest dialogue over there. Have I watched the VOD for Vrexia's 100% no hit? I have not. How long? What was the final time of the run? Uh, I dare say you're leaving little to the imagination. You know what? Maybe if you were around for the first 14 hours of this run, you would understand what's happening. Can't wait to start sniping some of these helicopters out of the sky. I only need four more aluminum, and then we can make it. Surprisingly simple to build. There it is. There it is. We got our deliverer. It's not as good because it doesn't have our upgrades. Don't have enough ammo to disassemble. Most folks are just looking for a hand. I want to shoot it so bad. Clothing. Can we make any clothes? Ah, we can. Let me get my sunglasses back. Most importantly, I need my sunglasses back. Cosplay. Oh, a chef's hat. Postman's uniform. I'm going to need leather. Yeah, I don't have any leather. So we got to go find some. Shouldn't be too hard to find. Actually, now that I finally have a gun. And we have the quest moving. We gotta go to the doctor. So, this is the famous Diamond City. I suppose I Anyone ever tell you that you look like a Walmart Michael Buble? Uh, I don't think I've ever gotten that one. I think that, that I think you might be the first. God damn it, the doctor's asleep. No way I'm getting away with that. Oh man, you got a robot butler? I love the conversation Codsworth can have with the uh, restaurant. I didn't drop my caps after reloading my save. <clears throat> At least I don't think I did. So I should be 
either at zero or very close to it. Uh, 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 Codsworth, can you leave us alone? Can you give us a moment, Codsworth? Please. Like to, but I don't have the money. Look, I can't let you stay for free. Yeah, I know, Yefim. If I can't stay here for free, I suggest we work something out here, yeah? Seems like we're getting along quite well. You there. Nice chat. Stop it! Bone structure. Stop by the mega surgery sometime. What? <gasps> Wait, there's the doctor. Doc. Even though I'm a doctor, I admit I have a small vice. A quick drink after work. And chopping up dead bodies in his basement. Okay, we need to get a few caps, but oh, I think they're closed. Should stop by Fallon's basement. Open one of fancy robots. I think the only person I can barter with is probably the robot out in the had we haven't scared you off yet. I gotta make some money. Oh Codsworth didn't like that. Again, Codsworth, I have a job for you in New Atlantis. They're gonna love you. Should be enough to at least get us a bed, and then we can sleep until the morning, and then we can go to the doctor, and then we can get moving a little bit more. Wrong one. Everyone in this city's always jumping at shadows. Chill out. They're having a sale on brooms. Let's see what you have. Anything and They say the old Boston Commons got some crazy bird living in it. Some. I think it ain't like 40 or so caps to get rid of uh, my reds. Get a preserved pie. It's worth it a bit. Oh, it's worth a bit? Nope. Tell me if you need a room. Otherwise, the bar is over there. Dude, I just want to rent. I'll take it. Room two is yours. Enjoy. Ever been up in the stands? Let's just say they can afford a lot of clothes. She's trespassing. Kind of, right? Cotsworth, close the door. No, Psst, take a look. Can I be of service? What's all pal? No, she wasn't. That was a... That was an intruder. Did everyone hear? See? Look, Codsworth. Nobody cared. We're all good. And we got some money out of it. I don't really know what he's complaining about. Are keys allowed? Oh, yeah, she has keys. Allen's basement. Now it's the next day. I should be able to rob her store, loot it up. Well, I'm only going to be able to take junk. I can't take any of the clothes, but it's a department store, right? Now a swatter. That's a real weapon. The Mokronin. No, I'm not gonna waste the red white. Oh, cram! Oh, so much cram! 
This is the greatest idea ever. Chat, you're all brilliant. You know, I make fun of you all a lot for giving me terrible ideas and stupid suggestions. But that one, right there, robbing her store, I think that might have just saved the entire run. Or at least made this portion of it way less annoying. No funny business. We offer a wide variety of medical treatments. Actually, I need some. I suppose I could spare some stim packs. Military cap. That's illegal, but the sunglasses I can wear. Cherry, right away. Da -da -da. Don't really need the right away because I'm not going back to the glowing sea anytime soon. Hey, Doc. Radiation poisoning is a common ailment, but we can cure just about anything. Yeah. Tell me your symptoms. I'm feeling sick. I... We'll clean you up, don't worry. All done. Any other complaints? 35? Can I afford that? Well, I'd patch you up. <laughs> I, I can't cover. Oh man, I really am. What else is bothering you? I'm really struggling right now. No other complaints. All right. Don't ruin my hard work by dying out. There. Dropping everything and starting from scratch really, really sucks. I don't recommend it. That's all right. Made me a little, so what? Made me a little bit thirsty? Don't care. I'll go drink out of the lake. Hey, tell your robot. We're fresh out of clumps. How long are we streaming? <clears throat> Naturally, I got parasites. That that should have been expected. I think parasites just make you hungrier, right? It's ass worms. Require more food. Yeah. Prescribed Kim, as recommended by me, myself, and I. Nice. Oh yeah, let's fucking go. We're good. I like having ass worms. I don't know about like. It's actually quite annoying every time we get it during a survival playthrough. Cricket, that you? Nope. Don't dally. If you're here to be examined, let's get you examined. Yeah. Now, oh, shit. Go over your symptoms for me, one at a time. That was it. Take better care of yourself in the future, okay? Doc. Let's get you examined right away. Time is not on the side of the surgeon. Could use some Barter, then cure. I can... uh -huh. Doc, you're putting me to sleep. Save the ammo. Don't Talk to the doc again. Here to be exact. Mm -hmm. Skip the dialogue. Yeah. Cure me. Over your... Go. It's great. Thank you, kind sir. <laughs> Thank you. Who was that? All done. Any other complaints? Ross doesn't care. Appreciate you. Thank you for the prime. Finally catching a stream. Sweet. Haven't been able to because of work. Unliving rain. No. I appreciate that you oh, don't you watch the stream on your company's dime. Actually. Now, if you can, if you can, if you can afford to watch the stream during work, 
honestly. I think I watched a lot of streams when I worked my IT job, especially the late overnight uh, shift. I got ammo, I got some water, I got some food. I don't have any armor yet. Why did I go to Abernathy Farm? I know the world has ended. But certainly we ought to strive for a Seems to be growing well. Codsworth, if you keep bitching about me being naked and showing off this awesome body, you, you can get out of here. Tato, Tato, Tato. It's Tato Mania. This feels like cheating. It kind of is. But I don't care. Now we go back home. We get back home. We break down our ammo. We make new ammo. We see if we can upgrade our pistol. And then we're kind of close to where we were in terms of power last time, just without clothes. Yeah, we need a lot. If I want to build the powerful receiver, we need quite a lot. Lots of screws, oil. We're just going to have to roll with the weaker version for now. It should get us through, though. Who's attacking? Not these guys again. Do you imagine if I died here and had to spin again and I dropped everything again? I was just getting warmed up. Yeah, the ammo's a lot lower. Still just need four aluminum. I feel like I should be able to find the aluminum that I need in Lexington or in Concord. Followed on YouTube because I'm on UK time. Yeah, that makes sense. The it, it has been a weird or not not a weird thing, but just sort of an interesting thing that really never stops being interesting as I do this is Everybody has different work hours, right? Like some people work day shift, some people work night shift. Some people are in the UK, some people are in the US. There's different time zones in the US. Some people are in Australia. So their time zone, they're living in the future. They're like, they're like a day and a half ahead of everybody else. Nice throw, saw that coming. Maybe don't telegraph it next time. Oh boy, Cods. Another one. Bro, get lower. Please get lower. What are you doing? That was awesome. I've never seen that in this game. That was like the coolest, tightest shit I've ever seen. Now, I mean, it played out kind of awkwardly, but that was sweet. They are fake Iron Men though, and they deserve to die. I don't know if I can do very much damage to them. 
We'll be killing by next stream. We're gonna be killing so many Brotherhood of Steel. Oh, they don't stand a chance. Carlos over there. How much cash do I have? 88, that's enough to get some aluminum. Except no, I don't see Carla. I hate when the cow and Carla are separated. We'll do Trudy and Patrick. Let's say we need aluminum, oil, steel, screws. We pretty much need all the important ones if we want to upgrade our gun and make it really overpowered again. Did you clear the Concord speak easy? I think so. Oil, yeah, we need to get some oil. Aluminum can, not sure why you're hoarding this one. Like, is she really gonna throw a fit? Hey, I was gonna use that. The NPCs in Bethesda games are like toddlers. They don't play with any of their toys, but the second you even think about taking one. Immersion ruined. Unplayable. Maybe I don't even need to buy aluminum. Gas canister, these are gonna have oil. Dude, dude. <laughs> Cosworth, I'm about to ship you off. Surely you meant to leave that rubbish where you found it. Hey. Yes, sir? Mother is already in the way. It's time for us to part ways. Right then, sir. Go. You're fired. You're fired. You're gonna insult me for the junk that I'm picking up that will save our society and destroy the Pridwin. I don't want to hear it. I'm tired of the mockery. I'm still gonna buy aluminum because we have to craft hey. I can quite a few things. That Wolfgang is rotten in hell. Thank you. I'll take a look. Sure. A little bit of everything. So let's see if we can get. Da, 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 da. We want to sell. How much is one aluminum can? Two aluminum for one can. So we have well over ten aluminum there. Sell most of the potatoes. I'll keep some of them for like emergency food. So we have 130 to work with. Screw for 10. Wood, I can find wood. That's a good deal. We'll get two of those. I definitely need adhesive. Ooh, but duct tape is pricey. Duct tape is a lot. I need some gears. Oh fuck, those watches are worth a lot. We'll get the typewriter and then we'll trade our way. I'm going to allow this. Are you going to upload this to the bot channel? Yep. Yeah, this stream will go on the bot channel. Oh, what I wouldn't give for a camera right now. Time flies when you're having fun praying for Juve's downfall so the wheel goes spin again. 
Oh, well, I mean, to be fair, the last couple hours I've been playing very boring, trying to just get my bearings back. That was... Yeah, losing everything sucked. I keep forgetting all the stuff that I was scrapping due to crafting goes right back in there. Don't tell me Sturgis is still, he's still at Sanctuary. Sturgis is annoying. Sanctuary. I knew you'd join us. Don't have any drugs for you, Mama. Believe me, as soon as I can, I will get you incredibly cranked. How's it going? Did you find a good spot to- Mm-hmm. Yeah. Ready to build the rest good. of it. Good. Here's a list of three things that may be harder to find. I'll meet you over at the building. Oh, sure. Thanks, hey, Sturgeon. Good deal. Time. One thing to keep it. I'll yeah. see you over. Mm -hmm. All by myself. No power armor. Okay, so we have to search three different sites to get what we need. Yes. Carla. Need to pick something up? It's pretty long. No, I can't afford to right now. All right, so we have to get three items. After we build the relay, how many more things do we have to do before we can uh, blow up the Pridwin? Does anybody have any like a rough idea? Because we're getting somewhat close, and we're at least set up to start the next stream with some power. I assume we need just a couple, nothing crazy. I'm curious to know what Sean looks like as well. We're going to find out. We're going to find out if Sean has the ridiculous chin of his father. All right, stick around if you're still here. I appreciate everybody who hung out uh, for a while. Thank you all so much for hanging out today. This was a great recording. I had a, I had a lot of fun. I've had a lot of fun with this challenge. But let's raid out. Let's raid out. I could send you to Oboe. Actually, I'll send you to Vrexia. We were talking about Vrexia earlier. So I'll send you over to Vrexia. Uh, they, they are significantly better at this game than I am. They are way, way, way better. Um, remember to be respectful. Don't be annoying. Don't backseat Vrexia. <laughs> they, they know what they're doing. Um, and I appreciate it. Thanks, everybody. Have a good one. Catch you later.